niggas to sit down. This is oh, no. to sit down, right? Maybe I told you I you got stand up. Be, I think so. Oh. Where we go? <laughs> what? Twelve coming. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode. You know what it is, baby. The Smoking Permitted Podcast. And if you don't know what it is, I just told you what it is, so you should know what it is. No, whore. If not, you kind of slow, guys. Man. What you doing here? I ain't in my end. We can't call them slow. Why you calling people slow, Bob? That's fucked up. Welcome to another episode, baby. This is episode number 120. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> This is 105, ain't it? Nah, let's read, let's Where the fuck now. was I going? Nah, we here now. Fuck it. We here now. <laughs> Where the fuck was I going? 120. <laughs> what is in that blood, my nigga? I don't know. What is in that blood? Because goddamn. Future no, serum. <laughs> I see it to the future. I was said at Sherm? 120. Serum. Oh, okay. Future serum. <laughs> I was in the future. Hey, you was whole, you held the twenty out like you had to think about how many twenties we did. We, I was because it was finna be twenty five. No, it was finna be twenty five. <laughs> we ain't did a single twenty. We now. ain't. We on one hundred five. Episode one hundred five. We appreciate y'all joining us. Um, uh, two five six seven eight eight seven three three nine. Call add me. To smokers at gmail dot com. Me. Google the Smoker Permitted Podcast. We the only one. Like. Comment, subscribe, do that. share, do it again, then do it one more time, then tell your friends to do it. And if your homeboy don't do it, tell him he got a problem with you. Tell him you're a hoe. Both um, of them things. Go leave us a review. That's like the best shit you could do. Like, we don't be asking y'all up. for no Click money and shit. We don't be telling y'all, like, like yeah, we do. But st- we don't want no money from y'all or nothing. Just leave us None a fucking it. review Just and make it five stars. Come on with and you can say whatever the fuck you want to say. Just put it five yep. stars and say some shit. Yeah, say some shit. You can Smoke say some, some shit. Smoke some, bitch. Smoke some, Shit, bitch. and don't forget to go join our fucking... We finna give away some studio right, time. Right, y'all bullshit. And y'all bullshit. Y'all gotta subscribe, and then y'all gotta go subscribe it's to gonna Ear Vision Studios, too. It's gonna be too late when the time's passed. And then y'all gonna be mad, because y'all gotta pay for shit. And don't say we ain't never fucking gave you shit. Ear Vision Studio. We try studio, to give you shit. Studio, um, studio. I'm sorry. I am Reverend Cato Jackson, and I am dressed to go to the beach today. <laughs> 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 I just realized that when I was looking at the camera over yeah. there. Um... This is my partner Bob Jaquez, and he is dressed like I normally be dressed. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit. <laughs> and uh, that is, what's your name again? White Mike. No, off, off White Mike. Off White Mike. Off off white white Mike. Michael Villano. Villano. I keep saying Villano, <laughs> that dude. Michael Villano. Thinking about the villains. I mean, okay. I don't know how this shit works. Michael Villano, Ear Vision Studio. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Go subscribe and shit. We in this bitch, we Mike. We in the bitch. Another one. How y'all been, man? How you been, Bob? How your week been, man? My week, I you know, I don't I don't never have much to say about my week, but I did have a couple of moments that I was like, damn, because I real quick, I'm, I'm not gonna spend too much time on this, but real okay. quick, I did have to. It's been a while, but I I had to. My kids almost died. No, see, I don't. This, it's a microphone right here. <laughs> like this shit record everything you say. My kids almost died, Kato. Shit. What? Well, okay, you didn't say you almost killed. Uh. Uh-uh. Okay. I didn't right. say that. I All said right. my kids almost died. Well, that's fucked up. Cause they think it's a fucking game. See? I don't know why they playing with me out there, bitch. Goddamn. Turn this, turn this microphone Boy. off. <laughs> turn this microphone. Can we turn this shit off? Look, hey, I, I had to. I had to get some get right and still back in my children. And I realized it had been a long time. So I was. Sometimes it was weird it. to be a little bit proud after fussing at them. This, this is probably the first time I had that moment. Was like, damn, it's been a while since they really, like, I had to really. Yeah, get no, you got, you really got six months. Them, you got to do that shit every six months. Um, uh, the other day, I maybe yesterday, I was calling to uh, set up because you know, you was here when my son was talking about the dodgeball, right? Okay, all right, <laughs> okay, all right, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. So I, I had to set up a glasses appointment. Okay. So we can go and grab the other. No, it's the same. Just, oh, okay. I, I keep forgetting um, the. When his, I get his son. <laughs> absolutely awful at dodgeball. Worst. I, he didn't say he was the worst person in the school at dodgeball. But he insinuated he was the second worst. The, the people that he <laughs> described as better than him, you would assume would be the worst people at dodgeball, but they better than. So Man. they might yeah, not know not. what was going on with yeah. Um So yeah, I set up an appointment. Keep point, in the face with the ball. Up, <laughs> set up an appointment. <laughs> right. I, I, I be fuck, you know I be fucking with it. Every time you say something to me, wait, what? You, you got hit with another dodgeball. Duck, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> with another one, bro. Who out the way? 
So I'm on the phone writing a little card, the card phone. I done called the people so I could ask some questions about last time he been, when he needs another appointment, and gets to get the replacement pair, yada, yada. So I'm talking to him, had a conversation, in the conversation, tell the lady, have a nice day. Okay, have a nice dude. evening or whatever. It was like 5 o'clock. So I have a nice night. So then I got off the phone, and my son's sitting there like, <gasps> what happened? Dad, I didn't, I didn't know you could, like, it was, like, you were, you were just like, you should have said indubitably. I was like, hold on, so I can't talk right? No, you wasn't, you wasn't sophisticated <laughs> enough with the eyeglasses lady. He said, no, he said he never heard me talk that well. Oh, you, he okay. didn't know I could. So you you just didn't over the indubitably would have put that, it that like, up there. Said, I might as well have said that. That's no. how I was talking. Is that I might as well have said that too? He ain't never heard your phone voice. I guess not. Oh I don't know. shit! I don't oh know. shit! I didn't feel like I did nothing way different. I bet you it, no. Everybody does. Himself. Everybody has a different voice. Everybody. I man, everybody. No, I know I had the different oh, okay. voice, but I, it was just weird that he was so. This is the first like, time. He ain't never seen me speak correctly. This nigga professional. Yeah. He pronunciated and shit. It was a little funny. He like he went to tell he went to tell people about it. No. Like, I, like, I, you I wouldn't like, believe it. The nigga you, I heard all the T's. <laughs> it's croissant. Man. That nigga said croissant. Hey, man. But uh other than that, now um R.I.P. my great Aunt June. R.I.P. Damn. Uncle Lawrence. R.I.P. to um, y'all, man. Yeah. It's fucked up. Yeah. Sorry, we we it's been it's been a while, and there was some great people. Folks had great times with them. I ain't a man. They, they had a good good time while they was here. So hell yeah, have a good time while you here. Shit, yeah, they yeah. had some fun. Do yeah, some yeah. Shit. June June was the cool aunt. She we we, we just called her Aunt June, but um, I just called her June. But she was actually my great aunt. But uh, yeah, so everybody everybody liked June. She was like the cool aunt. She be over there smoking cigarettes while everybody. Doing family shit. I ain't Sneak never heard a there. black person named Joan before. Yeah, I, it's a bunch of months in my family. So is I, I had a grandma named Early May. Early I see May. Doing too much. Early May. <laughs> not just May. Not Early May. May. Early May. Not middle of May <laughs> or late <laughs> May. <laughs> Your name is Early May. May one through ten. So my older sister used to be like, "See, fuck it. When I grow up, I'm naming my son Mid September. Mid September. I, mean, I get it, goddamn. Your yeah, name I is first May week of June. May, goddamn it. Right." So uh, and then, and my uncle Lawrence, he was my only uh, uncle or aunt on my dad's side. So my June was on my mom's side, Lawrence on my dad's side. So that was his only brother. So, but Lawrence is cool as hell. One time he called me, uh, he was looking for my dad. He called the house and I picked up the phone and he was like, he, we talked for a little second. He was like, hey man, you know what a strawberry is? Not a strawberry. <laughs> I was like, nah, Lawrence, I must have been like eleven or twelve. I know what a strawberry. I know you is. know that was. <laughs> Guess who taught? Who taught me what a strawberry was? Easy. He said, hey man, ask your dad what a strawberry is. And then hung up the phone. <laughs> Easy. He taught me what a strawberry was. Cause we didn't call them strawberries. Man, I didn't know uh, nothing about it. What? What's a strawberry? A strawberry, <laughs> strawberry. That's the neighborhood hoe. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> that was either easy or too short. That was one of them. I'm pretty sure that was easy. Yeah. Our dad said that's something they used to say in New Orleans and shit, cause they they, they lived there a lot in their life. I ain't never heard this shit in New Orleans. He said that's what, I don't know. My, my but they uncle, older than me too, goddamn. Yeah, and my uncle was a he was a wondering soul. No, <laughs> I got one, I got an uncle that's a wondering. Hey, um, what the fuck is dude's name? Uncle Jerry. Okay, then. The family ain't seen you in a long time. <laughs> if you see this, like, call somebody or something. Tell somebody what you're doing. Some, you hey, they, who, your, who your latest wife is, something. Bro, this, this motherfucker was talking about aliens for, like, like a couple months. And last anybody heard, it was in Utah. That was, like, 10 see, years ago. You play it now. You play it <laughs> On me, on everything. you doing too much. I'm not bullshit. Mm. On everything. Mm. Last, about 10 years ago, well, they heard us what in happened, Utah Jay. so well. Uncle Jay, come on now. Tell us what had happened but out my, there in Utah. All my girl, my kids crazy as fuck, though, so. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of that to happen. There's something about that, the baby boomer generation and shit right after nah, that. Hey. Uh, how was your week? Shit, what I do this week? <laughs> I ain't really do shit this week. I, I didn't went to work. I had a, I'm driving on the way from Chattanooga to Huntsville. I got a motherfucking 2018 Corvette. It's little in this bitch. Like, it's a Corvette. People like, ooh, Corvette, yeah. Like, after like 15 minutes of this shit, it's like, man, what? The, no, God man. damn it. It's getting dark. 
I ain't got no money. The, the headlights on this bitch don't work. Mm. It's dark as fuck on 72. Damn. Yeah, I'm in the Corvette. Vroom, no headlights. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I bet you look like you hauling drugs. <laughs> Damn, okay, though. So, yeah, I made my job give me a rule, but they ain't really, they ain't care for that. Like, you can put the hazard lights on it. Like, bitch, y'all got to be fucked up right. for real. No. Like, I'm not going no further than where I am. Y'all going to give me a hotel room. Um, South Pittsburgh, Tennessee, or Alabama, right down Tennessee, Alabama line. Apparently, this time of year, there's a ladybug invasion. Okay. I, I get to, I didn't know this. I get to my hotel room. I'm I'm looking first. You you do your bed bug check, goddamn. Okay. I mean it's a Holiday Inn Express, but you you never Where know. Where do you set your bags when you do that? And the, when you first get there, everything go in the bathtub. That's right. That's, y'all may if y'all may know. Everything go in the, the tub. Put it in the tub. <laughs> Till you check. And leave it there. Man, what? So I'm checking the shit. Oh, it's clean over here. I ain't shit back there. The fuck is that? <laughs> the fuck is that's a little bug? I ate it. I walk up to it. It's ladybugs. Around the fucking top of the motor. Just it's probably seven ladybugs in my fucking room. Okay. All right. I don't know if this is invasion yet. It's a note on the thing, on the table. On the little desk. That's how I know. Oh yeah, ladybugs invade this time of year every year. So you might have some ladybugs in your room. <laughs> if you want to, you can call us. We'll vacuum them up if if you want to, but they gonna be in there. Damn. So yeah, whoever going through the ladybug invasion right now, I I feel you. I feel your pain. Damn. Don't kill them. They'll leave like a yellow stain. Yeah. On the, it's supposed to stink, too. Do it. I don't, that's what the note said. Like, don't kill them. You the fuck out wallpaper. Yeah. Damn. Like, bitch, you could have so told me this at the front desk. Yo. What's crazy, though? Overnight, them ladybugs ain't fucking move. No, no. No, no. I mean, I walked time. up to a couple of them, and, and they, they was too? alive. Like, they moved a little bit, because, like, yeah, no, nah, this motherfucker here, y'all. So they moved a little bit, but... Yeah, no, nah, them bitches stay the same spot all night. Did you know horses lay down on their side to sleep? I thought horses stuck standing the fuck. No, nah, I've seen some horses sleep. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know they all riding down the road. It was like it's a dead that horse. bitch dead. First time I seen <laughs> yeah, one, like, I was I like, know is what that I'm bitch do about dead? It, but is it dead? So I googled that shit. It was like, nah, they sleep like that. Cause I thought they stood up and slept. Yeah, me too. Yeah, so first time I, I saw going. one laying down, I was that's a dead was ass two horse. Two horses by this tree, and I'm I'm pretty sure that one of the horses had his two back legs crossed. No. It was standing up. No. But like his front legs were fancy, regular. Yeah, yeah, the back legs was like right. crossed. Right. And I'm pretty, like I'm 87 to 92% that sure. That bitch got yeah, That is bad leg. <laughs> that bitch got that good weave, God damn it. All right. All right. 55 inches. That's God how damn. you find them. You got to spot them with their legs crossed. That's how you I was know. like, hell to the dog. Horses are tripping me out today. Yeah. But yeah, that was, Mike, what, what kind of week you had? I just came back from Florida uh, graduation. I ain't a mic. Congratulations on this shit. Appreciate Congratulations it. Congratulations and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, so just completed that, man. Had fun down there in Florida, man. And uh, came back to this bullshit ass weather, man. It was it was fucking yeah, lovely was down crazy. there, man. Came back, it was fucking 35, 32. And, nah, it's hot as hell. Yeah, but, but I enjoyed it. Had a good time, man. So it's just, you know, um, back to business. And um, I start school back in uh, uh, end of November. I start back. So, but other than that, just. Uh, recharging and and get and getting back right. All right, back well, to we're going to a little break. Hell, <laughs> yes, sir. Right. Little school Damn. break. I'm not going back to school ever no more. <laughs> I thought about it. Ever no more. I thought about it. Maybe truck driving school. Or None of CDLs. Not going to no school. I don't know if how many places I'm going to to start with an S. Subway. I don't go there often. Strip club. Subway. The strip club. It got a it got a name though. <laughs> see, see, I could, we could can exclude that. Stove. <laughs> you go to the stove, too. but you, it's still the stove. No. Yeah, I love the stove. No, I say the gas station, or I say the name of the place. I go to the stove. Yeah, I don't say that. I say I'm going to the gas station, or I say I'm going to Walmart, or Dollar Journal. Or, all them well, bitches. See, all you got to put the umbrella stove. No, I don't. Staying away from the mess places. Don't be trying to make me go back to school. Why you? Don't, you ain't got to go to school. Shit. You should. Everybody should. Fuck that shit. Learn some new shit. Y'all should. I like learning new Nico, shit. Nico, tell me what you learned. <laughs> I'm with it. Come let me know what that happened. So you school. want them to just come teach it to you? Mm -hmm. Yep, just let me know. Oh. Nigga, what did the teacher say Make at school today? Yeah, what he said? 
What else? You wrote some notes down? Let me see. Let me see your notes. <laughs> no, nigga. <coughs> All right, what we getting to, man? What is we getting into? There's a lot of people getting into a lot of shit. <coughs> you want to start with the good shit? You want to What kind of good shit we got then? I ain't even looking at all the shit. Tell me about Magic Johnson. Oh, I guess that is good, too. We got two good things right there in the middle of the board. Said, huh? Oh, he is a billionaire, ain't he? Yeah. He is. I do remember that. Yeah. Only like the third fucking athlete billionaire or some shit. I don't know. Yeah, I think they, it was. Because they had a, two different categories, some shit, where they be talking about ones that's still playing and ones that's not. So I don't know where he fall on that. I think he only, I think he was like list. the third or fourth athlete billionaire ever. That's what's up. I don't, care, I don't care what number I am. Give me the bill. Give me the bill. Okay, look. Magic 1, Johnson. 1,892. <laughs> like, I don't care what number I am in there. Give me the bill. So he, he owns a. He's is he majority owner of the Lakers now? I don't, he owns some of them bitches. I don't know how much of them bitches. Let me see. But he quick. owns some of them I bitches. Did. He owns LeBron. D- don't say that. <laughs> hey, you know that's what that shit is. That ain't what the fuck that shit is. No, he does not own that shit. LeBron. Is modern, it, it's modern day. It ain't slavery, but yeah. It's some white people that he's own a, a bunch of niggas for he's real. He's a part owner of Los Angeles Dodgers. The Dodgers too? And yeah. Los Angeles Spark. And this, Los Angeles FC. This bitch on all the LA teams, don't he? Yeah. He's among only three other athletes, Michael Jordan, LeBron James, and Tiger Woods, who have been declared billionaires. Um He he made forty million playing, but now yeah, he own he got the ownership in the soccer team, the women and the men's basketball team and the baseball team. And he but, and he's got an NFL team, Washington Commanders. No. Oh, he got something in there? I know he had Starbucks. Yeah, he did. Uh Burger King, it's 24 Hour Fitness, winning time. and a life insurance company. Yeah, winning time for real. Um, finna give me some Magic thought, Johnson life insurance. How much he had in the Lakers? Shit, I'm finna give me some Magic Johnson he got, life insurance. He's got four percent of the Commanders. Four percent. Four percent of the Commanders. Hold on, this this used to be the Redskins, ain't it? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so they they moved on from watching the football team. Yeah, they've been moved. Yeah, they've been commanders <laughs> yeah. for a while. I don't think they've been commanding them, but they've been the commanders Man, for right. a while. That's what's but, up. That's yeah. a lot of money. Four percent of fucking the NFL 1. team. One point two billion dollars is is what he's been declared to be worth now. That's what's happening with his with his ownership stakes in the different teams that he owns or is part of, and his different investments through different companies that he's invested in over time. Um, with those things combined, he has now surpassed a billion dollars, and and HIV didn't take him out. <laughs> you gotta have a billion dollars. That's the only way you gonna survive. You gotta have enough money. South Park told us right now. Uh, if my grandma played in the NBA, she'd be okay. She she'd be okay. All right. I'm telling you, Kanye was mad. Yeah, he can't be mad. She is. You should have learned how to do mad. jump shots. Instead of 808. That was a good song, though. Roses. Kanye I'm just West. saying. That's a lot of money. Billion dollars? Yeah. Shit, all but right. But yeah, congratulations, Magic Johnson. Congratulations. I'm mad they stopped that show. They had the, the, uh, the winning time. It's winning time. Yeah, they stopped the show. Oh, they don't have the show no more? They stopped. Have, they, they didn't even finish the season. They stopped He's on episode up. seven. It just he was too rich for this didn't shit. Didn't say nothing to do anything else. It was, he was too rich. I ain't got time for this shit. He wasn't on it. Oh shit! How the fuck is the Magic Johnson show? He wasn't on it. It was about the Lakers. Oh and shit! The owner. And oh shit! But I mean, he was one of the main characters. I thought it was like someone a, that played the Magic, Magic Johnson. Johnson show. No, I told you it wasn't. <laughs> you just kept saying it was. Yeah, fuck so. that! I'm, I'm staying with this shit. I ain't hear that shit this <laughs> time either. Hell yeah! yeah, yeah. I, ain't, I, I ain't hear that shit this time either. All right. Um, we got fuck some more that. clapping to do. Who was that before? I don't know his name. Find his name. Now. There you go. This little dude. Yep. Don't call him that. This little dude. <laughs> yeah, what you say mean? his name? Um, there's a young man, a young black man, that has translation. Little dude. <laughs> My enemy is translation. Yeah, young black man. My bad. I didn't. Oh, young black man. Yeah, little dude. <laughs> yeah. So what do you call a young white man? Little dude. Okay, so little dude isn't a translation for yeah. Uh, no, you just yeah. You should you should have been ain't something else because you just little, stepped little on bro. your own oh, little brother. See, okay, now you changing stuff. 
Um, this young man has. What's the dude name? He man. <laughs> he man, Bacal. I don't know how to say the dude name. <laughs> What is H E M A N? What's 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 H E M A N? Okay, all right, all right, all right. You said the same thing I said. You said the same okay, thing I said. Ethiopian born Virginia teen honored in inventing a potential skin treating soap. Skin ca- cancer. Skin cancer treating soap. I just skipped the fuck over the main He's word, didn't it? But yeah, he man. Bacal, a high school high school student in Fairfax, Iman Virginia. Beleki. His name he man. Is he? Iman Beleki. It costs eight dollars and fifty cent to create a batch of twenty bars of the soap, which he calls skin cancer treating soap, or SCTS. It sounds like a disease. Shit is for a disease. No, but it sounds like one. You got SCTS. <laughs> it sounds like a Cadillac, goddamn it. He created the soap in the eighth grade. That's what's up. And um, when when cancer cells develop, they weaken the den, dendritic cells. Yep, we're gonna go with dendritic. Okay. In the body, that all right boost immune responses. Okay. So the shit that that's supposed to fight the cancer, the cancer kill it. That's why the shit take over. So this soap is supposed to goddamn make more of the shit that's supposed to fight the cancer for real. Yeah, it turned the ones that's there in the he man. They turn them motherfuckers into He Man. By the power of Virginia, by Ethiopia, I have. Yeah. Yeah. That's what's up, though. I wasn't trying to invent shit. Man, I hate. This was had 14 years old. I went to Virginia a couple times by then. Skin cancer fighting. I did try to fuck something and ride some roller coasters. He won a $25,000 prize last year. That's it? Yeah. Yeah. This nigga probably found the cure for cancer. They gave him twenty five thousand dollars. Right, <laughs> took the formula. <laughs> Here you go. Now get the fuck out, little boy. Put your, in, your, your picture on the internet, little dude. Look for it, <laughs> <laughs> little brother. Hey, that's fucked up. That's, that's fucked up. up. That's what's up. Congratulations, Magic Johnson. Congratulations, Iman Beleki. You tripping, man. <laughs> You tripping. Dude name is He Man. Fuck that. He Man Bacal. <laughs> Bacal. Ain't no A in it. You know, Bacal. You gotta you gotta know how they pronounce it. I, all right. You right. He man Bacal. Yeah. That's fucked up. You What's need, fucked up? You need to try it. My man making t- man. He killing cancer right. out here. This is so so <laughs> he, he should be He Man. He no, killing cancer. He, he made the sales. He made the detrimental choices. See, he tried it. I didn't get to see the word. <laughs> Shout out to He Man Bacal. Shit. Do your motherfucking thing, yo, dude. Hey, He Man Beleki. Okay, little dude. Little bruh. Do your thing. I thought bruh was going to be the, the black dude. All of them, little dude. The little dude, white dude. I don't see race no more. Okay. All of them, little dude. Because you would say that's what you call a little black. Because you had make me change. Like, nah, he can't be the same thing. Well, you can, if you said it was for the black dude, it can't if be the same You said thing. what's for the black dude. No, you said it was for the black dude. No, you said what's for the black dude. So now I got to specify the one, you that said it's something young different. Black dude. No, Let's you move said on young to the black next dude. Topic. See how you be doing? <laughs> See how you be doing? Little dude, chill out, little dude. All right, little bro. What? <laughs> All right. Let me fuck my blood up. Tell him about the next topic. My lighter don't even want to work. <coughs> Lady Gaga. Tell him about the, tell him about the <coughs> Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga. <coughs> she crying. She mad. She sad. The fuck she sad about? The Illuminati. The Illuminati? <coughs> She's upset that she joined it, and she wished she never had, because now she feels all this evil stuff going on inside of her. So she decided to share kind of what happened and how she knows that that's what it's coming from. And then other people who filmed her documentary or her series or whatever she got out, (coughs) it's a movie or a docuseries or something like that. I'm never going to watch, but um, some of the people that worked on it were saying that there was some weird shit she'd be doing or she would like cut out a scene and tell them they couldn't use all this this footage because a higher power told her not to. 
I hate oh. shit like that. All right. But yeah, she she shared how she got into the Illuminati. And uh, one night she just got off stage of a great performance and some guy was just leaning, you know, he was just leaning, smoking a cigarette. And, uh, did, his legs was crossed, I bet. Right, the horse. <coughs> and uh, they had a conversation and at the end of the conversation, she ended up asking him what, who does she need to praise or who does she need to pray to? Something along those lines. And that is what uh, led to her being part of the Illuminati. But since she became part of the Illuminati, she at first, she had started practicing all these rituals and stuff. And she think that opened up something for evil stuff to come inside of her and start growing and manifesting. At this point, her life has been so many years, but she let the evil in so long ago that now it's taking a toll on her. Oh. And now she regrets ever joining. So she was just going to like just play with the evil for a little while <laughs> and be like, yeah, nah, evil, we good now. Y'all right. could just leave, That was man. fun. Yeah. That was fun. I don't, I don't know because they won't <laughs> answer my fucking calls, but I don't know if that's how the Illuminati works. I don't either, but also this was on a list of other celebrities that said... Well, the other ones didn't say themselves. It was just descriptions of how people think they got in. Like Chris Rock was on there. They said that the uh, he that's why he slapped Will Smith. Cause that was his he, introduction? Yeah, that's how he was going to get in. This the nigga Illuminati. ain't been in the Illuminati this whole time. Nope. He finally was like, fuck it, I'll go. He might not have wanted to go at first. You know what I'm saying? You get old, you be like, let's try something new. I'll be in Illuminati now. So now you got to let what Will Smith smack you. you. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Bitch, don't answer the phone for me. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> don't retire my call. So, I mean, that was on the same page as, as what they said about Lady Gaga. But Lady Gaga's had a lot more going on than just being like, I think this what happened. It was what like you, Lady you think, Gaga. You think the Illuminati real? Mm, I guess it depends on what context you're speaking about. No, again. like like they be talking about like like the conspiracy theorist thing, like the Illuminati, like behind everything, rule the rule and all this shit. It's like fucking twenty seven people running the whole fucking world or some shit for real. I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> I don't see why it wouldn't be a possibility. I mean, it's a possibility, but I would be surprised to find out this shit real for real. Why? Because somebody, some people, some, they gonna say some shit. The and Masons not when they go secret. crazy, God damn it. The Masons used to be a secret organization. Yeah, they used, it, it, they never fucking run the world. They kind of did. <laughs> That's why they were secret. <laughs> I don't think they ever read the world. <clears throat> the parts that matter. I, I, mean, I mean, granted, I don't think the Illuminati is, you know, on some island, somewhere with that island where they don't let you open there. You know what I'm saying? They not. It's parts of the I've world. I've seen they, island, but that might be a little. They might have been on there. Hey, well, whatever that place where they got really. the owls at, they be doing the rituals at and shit. I don't think it's a whole. I don't think. You don't it's, think no conspiracy. I don't think it's as many secrets as motherfuckers think for real. Because people gonna tell them fucking secrets, and it ain't gonna be like when Lady Gaga go crazy. Like somebody who in their right mind go tell them fucking secrets for real. Mm. All the time. That's why I don't, I don't think they we didn't caught no alien chips. None of this shit. I don't know, man. If these presidents know one of these presidents, would, Donald Trump, tell Donald Trump it's a fucking... But, all right. that's, that's if they tell him. Show him. I bet he gonna tell. Which they to be like, we ain't gonna tell him. You know how he get that. Man, okay. We ain't gonna say shit to him. <laughs> you can't tell him shit. Keep the button away from that motherfucker too, God man. <laughs> no, put the, put the red button on all the black people. <laughs> if it's yeah, trying no, to move the south side. A couple of them interviews I, I watched, I don't know them dude. The dude they were talking about, he was trying to um, revert. They were trying to reverse engineer the shit, and he talked about the element that that we didn't know existed till like 15 years later. Well, like, I can see some shit like, like that. It was like that. That I don't know. It's a couple times I have seen some shit to be like, hmm, all right, all right. I'm not picking either side now. So there. Like, <laughs> like I've seen some shit, yeah. and I've been these clouds been fucking with me for like a month, a month and a half. No, nah, what's wrong with the clouds? So, well, it be days with fake clouds, bro. They be fake clouds. Yes. All right, all right. <laughs> yes. All right. I guess you're right though, because if you say some shit, like you say, I'm crazy for yeah, real. Yeah, no, you can't say that. <laughs> yeah, ain't no like. Cause what? But no, like. <laughs> The motherfuckers be leaving fucking trails and shit. You could, I look at the sky enough. The airplane to, trails and shit. Yeah, but they'll, like, the other day I seen the shit and they left a fucking a asterisk in the sky. 
like a blatant ass, like they, like Maybe I don't know if they were playing training. around that day yeah, or what. Yeah, they might be with some training or something. I ain't never seen that, but it's just interesting. So that bitch turn into a cloud? Yeah, it does eventually. It drifts across the sky and spreads out and shit, but um, like for, for a few days in a row, like right up in the middle of the sky, there's a section of the clouds that has a little bit of a rainbow in it. Oh, that's weird. It's been like three days. So, whatever. And then like a week later, I'm riding this shit in the sky. And I'm like, that's weird. But all right, whatever. But it's days you could tell if you look at the clouds. Like, if you remember what clouds looked like when you was little. Like, it's there's days when clouds look like clouds. And it's days where that shit look like <laughs> different. <laughs> it just is. I'm for to show you. I'm for to show you that shape. Dude, this why I'm be. This why I'm be uh, talking to you, Kato. What you mean? I'm. I'm listening. I'm. I'm soaking it all in. What are they doing? I don't, they playing. I don't know what they're doing. How come there's some planes that just leave trails in the sky and some that don't? Nah, maybe it's the gas that put it in the beach. I don't, yeah, I don't ain't know. Nobody on that plane, bro. But like I say, it's some. Like we was talking about the. Sometimes I see an interview and be like, "Damn, that's interesting." I've seen a couple times where folks be like, "If." I only seen like two interviews where it would be somebody say they used to fly them planes that would be leaving whatever they'd be spraying out, whatever chemicals and shit. Yeah. And you know, it is like you could see on like there's videos of people is trying to actually make machines like ground based machines that make clouds. And yeah, stuff. the cloud seeding and yeah, shit. They do, yeah, like, I know they're trying to control shit. the weather and, and shit. Days yeah, they, they can the whole make clouds. Sky be like, All right, I was just talking shit. I know they can make clouds, clouds and shit. Like, we isn't. By the Redstone Arsenal and shit, so it ain't no telling what they right. hoping out for that bitch too, goddamn it. Yeah, I just be talking shit, but I mean, I don't really pay no mind to that shit, because, I mean, what the fuck can you do for yeah, real? Man. I just be mad when it look like the fake, like the shit looks fake. Yeah. Like, like, man. Can't do shit about it. No. Nigga, I told you, we living, like, this shit ain't real. But I don't want to go out and, and have one of the days where I want to go enjoy outside and that day be the day with the fake clouds. Huh? You just <laughs> you, you just saw pay it like they thought they tricked me. This shit ain't real for real. Ain't none of this shit real. All the clouds probably uh, fake as hell. Well, I like the real fake ones instead of the fake. Yeah, it would. Somebody on their off day, somebody went on vacation, there's a new nigga making clouds. <laughs> This like, nigga oh, don't know he's built the clouds. Man, wait. <laughs> Who the fuck trained this nigga? Why the fuck them clouds so thin, goddamn it? The fuck is you doing to the clouds? See how you know they was thin? Because I know how a new nigga <laughs> do. He ain't put enough clouds just in that bitch. He tried to skip on that shit. He gonna try to sell it later. Man. Think I can make a gender reveal cloud for you, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. Pink ass clouds just fall Man. from the sky. Everybody got canceled. I was tripping too though. That every like every day for three days, it was a fucking. It wasn't a whole rainbow in the sky. It was just one little area that looked like a bit of a rainbow. And the bitch right ain't there. even move. Mm-mm. Yeah, see, I'm telling you, this shit ain't real. It's just not. There was a sign from somewhere. They wanted you to see that. I'd be wondering how far away other people. How far away can we see the same clouds as someone else? Like, it's an interesting. Yeah, I ain't never wondered over, that, but it makes sense. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think you're gonna see it a couple states off. Now you got some binoculars or some telescope. Well, how you? What do you need? Where does it stop at? When can I not see the cloud in Huntsville anymore? I feel like you could you could drive away and not see that bitch no more. Yeah, but when? How far do I gotta go? Knoxville? No, no like Birmingham. The other side of Huntsville. No. Nah. What? I be, like Kato, a couple I be driving, miles that way, probably. I be driving probably. for an hour and be seeing the same shit in the sky. Maybe. I guess I don't pay enough attention to the shit in the sky. I be looking at the sky. But clouds be moving and shit, too. Some, not, so sometimes maybe you, they move you fast be going in the same direction as them bitches. Y'all just racing the way you go at the See, yeah. Sometimes we are, but sometimes. You got to turn around and opposite the bitch. Because you can see it. Usually I'm going parallel, to, uh, perpendicular to them. Actually. Yeah, I don't pay that much attention to the clouds. The sky just be right there. What you be looking at? The road? Because I be driving. What you mean? <laughs> but the sky is in part your view of the road. If you look at the road, the sky is right there. All right. It's it is. It. Yeah. You just look like, damn. What, what I'm, you I'm be, not, I don't, I'm not focused up here. Like? <laughs> I'm not focused up here. I don't, the, the clouds ain't my focus when I'm driving. No, nah, I just, I don't, I don't focus on the clouds. You don't have I'm right here it. with it. Yeah, I'm right yeah, here. You know what I'm saying? That's, the clouds is right in that picture with me. That's too far out there. I'm not, I ain't looking at the oh, horizon. No you, ain't the, you can't see the horizon. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say it right. You can see the clouds. That's what you, I don't know. 
We seeing different you shit. Gotta pay attention next time. No, I'm good. I'm paying attention <laughs> to the shit on the ground. I'm, I'm looking for deers and shit. I be looking for them too. No, I ain't looking for the <laughs> fucking fake clouds. Man, I had, oh, this man. All right, we need to move on. But this man rolled by me speaking of deer because I. It's a few times this week I had to slow down for some. Like, I seen him way up there. It was like, uh-uh. Yeah. Y'all going to finish doing what you doing before I get to you. Blow <laughs> like, your horn. Yeah, I blew my horn at one, one time. They, they bitches didn't do don't, they, they just they look just at you like, bitch. It's better when I don't do nothing. But, uh, so I had somebody coming on the other way. So I flashed him and like, hey, motherfuckers in the street. Goddamn, you might want to slow down. So a little bit down the road, somebody flashed me. And I'm like, oh, shit. Motherfuckers in the street. Yeah. No. Either 12. The boys pulled out. I was like, ah, oh, you tried to warn me and you got got. Damn. Oh, yeah. They, they can't too. see you do that. They hopped his ass down. They got behind me a couple of times. I flashed my lights to somebody. Yeah. Nah, don't let them yeah. see you. They don't pull me over, but they done got behind me. Like, bitch, you warning people? Yeah. I'm like, yeah, bitch. Oh, no. He was way past it. He was just booking. I could tell he was slowing down. Hell. His flash should be like, okay. Nah, yeah. It was over with for yeah. him. Hey, on his head. Yeah. It's too late. If you're going fast as fuck and you see him, yeah. you better go faster, guys. That's what I was thinking. Boy, if he had had any sense, because it was a man see. standing by a truck, pulled off on the side in this little field. It's like he should have pulled up on my man and just hopped out like he know him. Man, what? Yeah, any sense, because it, it took the police a little second to pull out of that. Anyway, we, um, that's the best advice I can give you on that, though. If you're going fast as hell, if you're doing over 100 and you see the police, do 140. If you on the interstate, maybe. If you on the, it, the county you road You're going 17. to jail wherever you at. Yeah. you going to jail. But it's easier to drive the interstate than the county but road But you already 17. doing 100 on the county road. I hope you know what you're doing here. Nah, Shit. So some of them, I'd be worried, boy. It's just, whew. Maybe so. Uh, what you want to move to? What we going to? I don't know. I can't, well, I, I, you, you, you say it. What, what I'm saying? Whatever you picking off the board. Oh, shit. I guess we got another list. Oh, we're going to, oh, that's right. I, I can't get the, to the list. What the tell fuck me the list is? Yeah, you sent it to me. I forgot. It's a good list this time. I got it. I, I got guess. it. I guess. Woman drops list. list of things you should do for your man as a woman. There's two of them bitches. Oh, I see the second. There's one for the man and the woman. Oh, these are long lists. Why do people? They, they, they doing a whole lot of shit. They doing a whole it. lot. So let's see. <laughs> um, we ain't going to read all these motherfuckers. First, the top three. Ones you want. Be safe. Be his safe place, <laughs> his comfort zone, and feel like home. Bitch, you a house. Um, yeah, you a house. And what if he never had a home? <laughs> listen, be understanding, and be patient. Okay. Um, And feed his soul. This three mm-hmm. and four. Bitch, how you... I guess this nigga's so right. hungry. You wanted to read this. this th- I'm just saying, we read the other shit last week, so it's only fair. Did this shit pop up? I don't up? think it's fair this popped up. We I run the other shit. They made this. What's some more? Pray for him. That's um, number <laughs> six. Motherfucker needs some prayer. <laughs> um, number 12, good advice. Give him some space. Um, cook for him. That's some good advice. Be be respectful. Is don't go through his phone on there? Um, you know, Let's put um, some a is, woman made this list. Is don't nag on there? A woman is. made this list. So you know don't go through his phone. It's not on this motherfucking list. I'm trying to find something good on there. I ain't heard nothing good on there yet. I heard a lot of good. Give him some space. That's that's some good shit right. for real. Mm, Cause that's gonna come at that's gonna be resentment. Give him space without resentment. You just gotta say this stuff right. We need this list to get picked be, up. A be nurturing. Bit. That's some that's some good shit. What they say to do to the soul? Feed the soul. Feed the soul and be nurturing. I don't know how you feed the soul. Oh, that's, nice. All right. Yeah. Oh, what's the other list? What to do? Hold on, about? what else on here? Be able to take care of yourself. That should have been like number three. God damn it! That that should have been way up. That's number. What the fuck number is this? Be able to take care of yourself. That's number motherfucking twenty three. That should have been number three. That twenty Dang, spots that's too wild. late. So for twenty two spots, she just been stanky. <laughs> <laughs> and ain't got no job or none of this shit. Bitch just sit at home she stanky. watching the stories. Bad. Damn. I ain't got no bus pass. I ain't got no bus pass or nothing. That's fucked up. Let's see what the men said. What they could do was really important on the first date if you want to impress her. This this what some niggas came. I don't know. Some men came up with a list. There's a picture of a nigga next to it. Um, be there early so you don't leave her waiting. Um, that's not good advice. If you be there early, 
You're going to be waiting for a be while. Waiting. <laughs> be there on time. Right. Maybe five minutes early, but that's all. <laughs> Don't show up 20 minutes yeah, early, and hey, your ass just going to be there. Done. Fuck that. Somebody oh, else could have ate and left by then. Grab her some flowers and a small card. I don't know about that. Let her know you appreciate her time. I don't like flowers. Yeah, you don't no, want no snotty You got to ask a motherfucker if they like flowers for you buy flowers. Yeah. Because really, flowers like... Sixty dollars for the fucking some roses that you're gonna put on your counter for about four days. I don't really agree with that shit neither. Oh, spending sixty on the first date for flowers? That's what flowers cost shit. All right. Oh, we at Walmart. Fuck yeah. Twelve dollars. Yeah. <laughs> fuck. These fuck I don't even know what kind of flowers these is. Sixty dollars for the first date. That's twelve roses cost sixty dollars at you least. Must, God you, damn dating, it. you dating out of I'm not dating. Yeah, I'm not buying no flowers on the first date. No way, though. That's what I said. You got to ask a motherfucker if they like flowers before you buy flowers. And so you ask her before the date, and she be like, yeah, I like flowers. No, not on the first date. There might be something you ask on the first date. Okay. And you might bring them bitches to the second date. But yeah, first date don't get no flowers. Not for me. Have you ever pulled some flowers out from behind your back? Voila. No, I ain't never done that before. (laughs) I ain't never done that. Magic trick, bitch. (laughs) Mike, you ever pulled some flowers out? Nah, I ain't never. Uh, <laughs> I can see watch, him die. Watch me pull some flowers out of my way. back pocket. Nah, you know how they be in the movie and they be having yeah. it behind their back? Nah, I ain't never did pop that. out. Yeah. Motherfucker like, make a sound and everything. the flowers off. Yeah, what? Well, you be I agree, though. Live the fucking stems and shit here, well? I, I agree, though. You, you need to find out a lot of things where you just buy people things. Hell, yeah. yeah. Especially yeah. some shit that, yeah, if this shit more than $5, yeah, she gonna be sitting there snotty. I need to know you want this. Y'all, you went to the nice restaurant, so they don't even got paper napkins. They got the cloth napkins. She can't might even be, reuse it. Might she be got, allergic. Right. Right, she right. Got, she got asked you the, roses, the waitress. I can't she got asked the waitress to take this snotty ass rag back and bring her another dry one. I don't know. Because you done brought these flowers to the first day. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. Yeah, so yeah, make no sure she wants some flowers before you buy nothing. some flowers. Um, open the door for her. That's simple enough. You can open the door for her, goddamn. I don't know. I'm I'm at this place where I just don't know if that's. I open the me. door. For, if I'm coming and it's a female, if I'm coming through this door and it's a female on the way to this door, I'm gonna hold this. Yeah, door. I do that in general, but I'm talking about. But yeah, on the date too. I'm a, I'm, somebody, I'm, I don't, I'm open the I don't door. Know if I'm doing that no more, like yeah. I, I'm like open none of the up. doors. I might be done. I might have did all the door opening. Really? I might have. I don't That's, know. You got to open these hoes doors, Bob. Man, I don't know if I'm doing that Bob, shit. Bob, you no got to open these hoes doors, Bob. I'm going to tell my son to do it. <laughs> I, I agree you with can't you. Know. Hell, no. I, I agree with you, though. Know, it depends. Like, car door, I'm not doing car door. I did all the doors. Like, that's what I'm I saying. Did like, all yeah, the, I'm, I'm going to do a car door for a little she, while. She a it depends door. on what No, what I, it wasn't a little while. It was. The entirety of the time, which wasn't no little. Yeah, I'm, I'm opening yeah, the door. Oh, Maybe I, not I the car doors all door. the time. But oh, yeah, yeah, I did. I did but, all but the doors. If we walking up to a door, I'm going to yeah. open the motherfucker. What, what is she a fast walker? You going to uh, jog her to the door or you going to let her get it, get the door? It, it, it depends on how I'm feeling <laughs> right there. It depends on how I feel. I know, so you can't wait on me. You can't wait on me. If you wait on me, you open your own goddamn door. <laughs> you can't wait on me, goddamn. Dang. Yeah, no, nah, you can't just stand there and look at the door. Dang. Yeah, hell no. Hell no. What is she turning back and look at you? Nah, I don't give a fuck. Nah, open the door. If you here, open the door. If I don't beat you, then, then yeah, <laughs> open the goddamn door. I'm going to try to beat you there, but if I don't beat you, then you should have slowed down. That bitch, open the door. I hold yeah. the fuck, we got to Yeah, I feel, I'm, I'm temporary retiring. Temporarily no. retiring my door. I did. My door card. What I else did. we got? Um, settle, eat, settle her with a hug. Give her a hug on the first so, day. I don't want to hug your ass. No, on some you really day. right. Yeah, this is the first date. I did. Be attentive. Stay off your phone. This you shouldn't be on your phone on the date for real. Oh, um, make sure to look the, up her jail record. Make sure to smile. She ain't give her real name yet. <laughs> make sure to smile and keep eye contact. You don't Call even know they told you. Name. All right, <laughs> all right. Miss <laughs> Duke, Queen too cute. Miss, yeah, what? <laughs> Miss Slay the day, God damn it. Shit. Miss Big Bags only? Man, I ain't. <laughs> it's just with the reservation of the God damn it. I got a reservation for Miss Big Bags only. <laughs> That's us. <laughs> Bitch, I'm finna go home. Oh, Should have told this man your name, God damn it. Damn. Are you good at remembering names? 
Are you gonna I'm ask the name again? Remember, names. Names. remember that your ex don't exist. Damn. Yeah, I, I guess <laughs> that motherfucker disappeared out of here. Shit. Pay the whole bill. Then when you drop her off, walk her to the door. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> yeah, nah, walk her, walk her to the door. Is it her door? That it makes a difference. Yeah, yeah, it like, makes a difference. I'm not walking you to your mama door. That's all the rules. All right. That's Yay. all. Hey, more lists. Fuck them lists. I think we we done with lists for a little while. Thank God. Thank. Because y'all God. wild and y'all want too much and y'all trying to do too much. We get clicks and likes and that we fed into it. Dude, that's what we we here for. Yeah. Um, I don't know, man. I'm I'm kind of in the mood for some music. Some music. Yeah. Who got some songs at? <laughs> Well, it's not that anybody's released any music that you would have heard of, because okay. I have heard some good new music lately. But um, there's this old man that used to be part of a rap group. Okay, then I like old rap groups. It's called uh, Public Enemy, right? Public Enemy, number one. Um, okay. Yeah, I fuck with Public Enemy. Bet. There it is. Uh, he got an opportunity to sing the national anthem. Would you sing the national anthem if you had a chance to? Absolutely. fucking Yeah? I can't sing it. Anyway. I can't. I don't give a fuck. The biggest stage, the, the bigger the Super stage, Bowl. the better. And what you mean? <laughs> what? <laughs> Shit. Give us a little bit Shit. of it. Shit. Now we ain't at the Super Bowl. Come on. You said anywhere. I said I asked anywhere. You're not said, here. I, come on. No, uh-uh. We, no, uh-uh. Cue it up. Me, 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 me. You don't even do that. You fucked up already. <laughs> All right, show us how to do it. I ain't going to do it, though. All right, that's fucked it. up. Okay, we oh, need a stadium. On. We need a stadium. Do it for the show. No, we got we, some applause. We need a stadium. Nah, well, that ain't enough. Gunshots? Mm-mm. We got some fouls. Foul. We need a stadium. And then right. I got to be standing up. I got I to gotta bust a lap first so I can open up my goddamn vocal pathways and shit. I didn't know this. Had it go. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. From the diaphragm. You didn't go from now. No, nah, that's it, I just caught it right here because it was on the way up already. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Mike, you singing the national anthem? Uh, if you pay me, yeah, I would love to. Okay. Yeah. Only for the I money. Would. What about you? You missed the bag. Look at you. No, it don't matter. No. I, no, they, they got it. I, I thought that I was understood. So. There's a time in my life I probably would. That's why I wouldn't now. do it. I thought it was understood. It had to be the checking or somewhere. Nah, nobody saying nothing about no check. <laughs> That's understood. I, might, said, uh-huh. I might need a little auto tune or something. Yeah, I ain't yeah. going nowhere yeah. without the check. No, yeah. no check for you. Mike got the money. Off white Mike. <laughs> well, he's singing, Mike for the he's singing that bitch then. Hey, I got a. I ain't mad. I got where. Where I can get a cue though where I can play it. All right, let's yeah, Flavor Flav. Yeah, Flav. 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 Seems Sing, the national anthem. Yeah, Flavor yeah, Flav. Yeah, Flav from Public Enemy. At the Milwaukee Singing the Star Spangled Banner, performed tonight by six time Grammy Award nominated rapper and artist six time Flavor Flav. Flav. He could have said Come his on, name Flav. better than that, too. Flavor Flav. I ain't in my hand. Oh, oh, say. Hey. Can you see? Not you. I ain't got a hat to take. By take the dawn. Yeah, hey, I'm finna kneel. <laughs> what you mean? That's right. We supposed to kneel. That's right. Look at, look at me programmed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's so proud? That's right. Come on, Flay. Come on. At the twilight, you know job moves. Hey, hey, hey. Light, <laughs> last gleaming. Okay. Whose broad stripes uh-uh. and bright stars. Oh, what a music in this bass line. Oh, okay, that's enough. Why that's play? enough. That's enough. They got to they got to go and listen to the whole flag on their own. We ain't Flav gonna do that. Flav ain't out here. Playing out here. She you is. heard the vocals. Me and Walking Bucks in this you bitch. You heard the vocals. I was stop playing with Flavor Flav with a big ass clock on every time. Man, you doing it better she. than you. 
would you have sang her better than that? Shit, I can't say I would have. You <laughs> feel me? Like I was saying for a bad I say, can't hey, say I, I would I, have. Uh, I don't I'm even know mad. the song, obviously. Shit. I'm not mad. Folks is mad. Shit. Folks is mad at Flavor Flav. Fucking Flav. And That's Flavor Flav came bad. out with a statement. He was like, hey. I would try to do shit I ain't gonna do for. I'm gonna do the shit I ain't do for. You bitches, man. I ain't ask y'all to say, <laughs> God damn it. How the fuck did Flavor Flav get to sing the national anthem? She, that's Flavor Flav. Yeah, but how the fuck did Flavor Flav get she, to sing? She, that's Flavor Flav. No, I mean, no. She, Flavor Flav no. pop up anywhere on the motherfucker. He might be from Milwaukee. I don't know. He could, they could see, that could be why he, 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 I don't know, but she. How the fuck did Flavor Flav get the, a house full of bitches compete for his love? That made more sense than this. <laughs> oh, you see Flavor Flav? Yeah. <laughs> that don't make no sense. Yeah, because we'll have a show because they'll be here with the ugly <laughs> Man, okay. This doesn't hey, make any he sense. He might be from Milwaukee. Maybe he is. But Maybe she, that, look, it went viral, I did. It did. And it, I enjoyed it. Hell, I yeah. enjoyed it. I, I, only hope, heard, I hope he do this I shit every the, game. the Ramparts part in a little clip before just now. I hadn't heard that much of it. That was, yeah. that was amazing. He sung that I bitch. enjoyed that. Um, they need to hire him tried. to do that shit every night. Yeah, he tried. She, I don't yeah. see why. Like, she and Flav Flav in this bitch. I'm with it. I don't know now. One song from him, but I'm with it. Public enemy number one. <laughs> <laughs> Fight the power, you know. What oh, I'm I know. Yeah. I've heard of fight the power. I don't know it, but I know what you're talking about. Fight the powers that be. Okay. Yeah. Dun, 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 dun. That's all I know. I just know he'd be like, "Yeah, boy." That's, that's all I know. And he got the clock. Yeah, he do. And he had to show. Flavor Flav was the hype man for real. Yeah. He ain't never. He wasn't a rapper for real. He was like the first Crunchy Black. That's how I look at it. But Crunchy Black got a verse on the songs. For yeah, that's why he was the first Flavor, Crunchy Black. Flavor, like, Flavor was the first little John. He, he didn't was, make the beats. He didn't make the beats. He uh -uh. was the first Lil Jon on the he track. He was the first Crunchy no, Black. No, 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 he did beats too, though. He, he played play piano real good. Did yeah. he? He does might play did. classic piano. He might piano. did make the beats then. We all know. He played the shit at the piano. Yeah, he yeah. plays classic piano. But yeah, Public Enemy was real. Dang. Black Glove, like. Yeah, I, saw, yeah. I know. Like, I've seen pictures and heard, like, seen little moments of it, but I don't. No, Chuck D. I've through a whole song now. Who else was Chuck D? Flay Flay. I think Chuck Terminator D just had a verse with DJ. Terminator X. He yeah. was even doing a lot of beats for Terminator X. Yeah. On a um, DJ K Slay, R.I.P. Got a, a, a hour long beat out with a shitload of rappers on it. I no. think uh, Chuck D was Shit. on it. Rev Run was long? on it, and uh, who's the dude who lost his voice? Who don't have it? DLC? Yeah. No. Yeah. The who's DLC. You talking about no, the, no, no. the formula? No, the East Coast one. Not the West Coast. The one that was with Rev Run and one he in Jam Master J and I don't who, I know the, who's the run DMC. He was waiting on AI so he could use this shit because his Benny voice C. was fucked up. Nah, the other yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. It was another one. Uh, well, yeah, he he was on that too. There's a couple old school rappers that was on that shit. I couldn't imagine listening to Chuck a motherfucker on. selling this an hour long. Yeah, it's a, he, everybody had like eight bars or something like that. I don't want no like parts that. of this shit. An hour long? Change this goddamn beat. Shit. Maybe it changes. I hope so. <laughs> Shit. I hope Maybe so. Maybe not, but K Slade would do shit like that. He put out a long ass. Throw this shit with, away. With, like everybody on it. Um, congratulations, Flavor Flav. You got a lot of good on the board today. Man, man. It's man. a good motherfucking week. You usually don't be having this much good stuff. Oh, I guess while we playing clips. We going straight to that. Yes, we we going to say that. We might as well. We might because it's been. Too, it was too much good shit. Right. <laughs> it was too much. Uh, the good rest shit of it is good on. shit. So I get well. Maybe one more. Maybe one more. Maybe. <laughs> the nibbles. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Stay around for the nipples. <laughs> Stay tuned. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Nipples. Conversation about coming nipples. soon. Coming your way soon. <laughs> okay. On the Smoking Permitted Podcast, episode 105. See you. 256 788 7339. Call us. So, <laughs> fucking Joe Smith. An ex NBA player who we, I don't do know anything know, about. You don't know him either. Off White Mike, you know who the fuck Joe Smith is? Man, before I, before I had seen the incident, I didn't know who he was. <laughs> I didn't know who he was either. Right. I ain't never heard of him. Hell, I thought but, uh, it was Joe I don't Johnson. Follow, 
you know what I'm saying, you know, closely either. Yeah, me neither. Yeah. So. Nor did I whenever Joe Smith played because it had to be a long time ago. Hey, that ain't like the most fucking right? generic name right? you can have. When I was writing it, it felt weird to write Joe Smith. Joe Smith. And this shit like, ain't real. <laughs> Joe Smith, yeah, you're going right. to jail. <laughs> That's that false right. information. You get used in every example. Man, you okay. got all the math books. Joe and John. <laughs> if Joe Smith had seven apples. He gave his brother John three. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. One of them bitches got a worm in it. <laughs> How many apples are edible for the Smiths? Man, what? <laughs> Uh, Joe Smith. School. Uh, he had an incident where he um, discovered that his wife. Well, let's play the clip. Here, just finding out you got an OnlyFans page. Out of all these years, you know, the disrespect that comes with it, that you really were talking to me before you did it. That's bullshit, though. That's fucked up, Keish. It's fucked up, Keish. That's fucked hey, up, Keish. Wait, no, no, no. Calm, but we're not going to say fuck me or that's fucked up. It's not I'm fucked up. Yeah, you didn't even talk to him. <sighs> Listen, it's not fucked up. And we're going to... Up. Okay, look. So I have an OnlyFans page. And he's mad because he's just now finding out about it. Of course I'm mad I'm just finding but out about it. I'm not doing it with anybody but myself. So why should I have to tell you my choice, my body? My body. It's just not what my body and my Yo, choice I mean, bitch. I've been talking to you about mad things. I've been asking for solutions to shit. You're not giving me none, so I created it. No solutions. Not in my book. You knew, you knew who the fuck I was when you met me. Before, oh, shit. Before, she been a hoe. Yeah, before, yeah, before, yeah, before, I, I thought that. that I would never have to go Man, back to anything like that again. That's unfortunate. That's not the case right now. Everything's supposed to change. Everything did change. Hey. Alright. That's um, wild. When well, he had some money, everything changed. Damn. So he yeah, oh, wow. So I didn't I didn't know he knew already or that was something that some she might have did in the past. Right. That he like, nah, I wanna know what she current. Used to do. Like, yeah. It, it I wanna see her old is, work. It sounds like Joe <laughs> was rich and met a hoe. Mm-hmm. And now Joe money kinda low. Mm-hmm. So the whole ready to go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's what it sounds mm-hmm. like. So one of them Lowe's hoes that you had to work on. Man, okay. Work on. <laughs> <Man>. <laughs> That's wild. But she, I wasn't really fucking with it until she said, you knew what I was when you met me. And Joe didn't say like, bitch, what? What you mean? <laughs> like, so Joe said, knew. I knew. Yeah. Said, I knew. <laughs> so really? Like, yeah. So this all on Joe. You can't be mad at a hoe for being a hoe. You can't. Can you be mad at a hoe for coming out of retirement? You can't. Especially not if you met a hoe when you was rich. She's sneaking it on the low, too, though, evidently, because she didn't even run it by him. She must have did a little bit afterwards. You're right, though. Because it had to have something. Because it had to be afterwards. He was like, okay, I know you used to. She even admitted to, like, hey, I'd have moved on from that, but mm-hmm. she sneaked a little bit out, and he didn't found out about after they, said, you know, no more after this. this, and she evidently did it again in, without him knowing. Later in the video, it was some shit about goddamn her trying to figure shit out, and he he couldn't figure out how to help her figure the shit out, so she found a way to make the shit work, goddamn. Yep. And this was OnlyFans, so it sounded like Joe Money Low, goddamn. Yeah, no, nah, for sure. And this bitch like shit, I know how to hope. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> they took it to the internet like so, PMC said, so shit. Yeah. What y'all what y'all doing? Y'all oh, know y'all go. know what y'all doing. She What's gotta go. Hell no. Know, she, she, but no, she I got guess the money now, though, right? Joe knew what he signed up and for. They though. married, right? So and yeah. they is married. But Joe, I guess that, that's what fucked me up. So you knew what I was when you met me. That what fucked me up. The camera would fuck me up. Yeah, that oh, too. Damn. Everybody pull out the camera that guy did. Damn, man. bitch. Put the camera out. But hell, she put that pussy on camera. She might well put y'all but, on but, camera. And, and if you look yeah, at the Joe video, why, no why is he fussing with his back turned too? That tell me a lot. Uh, that tell me a little bit. Like, why are you fussing with your back turned? Well, he don't want to deal with his face even on know, the camera. You know, yeah. like he, he ain't want to be seen. He ain't want her, her putting that camera on him. Joe, this fuck. Damn, Joe, Joe. Hey, Joe is. It goes to show. We've been rhyming since we started this nah, shit. Nah, I'm just going to let you keep going. <laughs> but it goes to show you can't trust the whole job. Can't trust the whole job. Uh, what's a hoe? Always a hoe. 
I, we talked about this a couple way, episodes ago. We, we, we talked about this. Shit, a hoe's going to do what hoes know to do. Yeah. Shit, if you can stop the hoe from hoeing for a little while, but when whatever vice you got so in there. So don't no hoe, hoe ever like retire for good? I don't think so. Okay. I don't think so. If that's it's what like they a, know, it's shit. like a virus. Like you just it's can't not, get rid it of it. I don't even know if it's a virus. It's like a trade. When you learn, if you learn how to plumb, you know how to be a plumber <laughs> for the rest of your life. Let's, let's, I'm saying. Let's, so let's, if if you get the money get low and you need a job, what you going to do? What you go? What's the first thing you gonna try to do? I'm not going to plumb. No, no. <laughs> if you a plumber, that's what you know to do. You're not gonna go look for a job. Well, then you gonna that, go. That makes sense. You, you that go, makes it's sense, a trade. Though. She learned how the to sell that pussy. The plum, yeah. yeah no, no. Don't yeah. tell me I'm going to plum. She oh, get, it's just a train plumbed. popped in my head. Yeah. She's getting plumbed. Yeah, it's, yeah. Hey, somebody plum it, gee. So, what if she ain't doing nothing but like showing her toes? I don't feel like Joe would be that mad. I feel he don't, like, maybe he don't know yet. I feel like he know. I feel like he, nah, he's some, saying it. Somebody told him. He was, very yeah, upset. He was like, hell he's no. Yeah. You know, that's the first thing. Hell no. He's well, she, the cabinet. Nigga, look, man. What? <laughs> <laughs> it ain't my wife, nigga. Look at her. She it. We all seen it, Joe. We all seen it. Bust it open. <laughs> all your bodies seen it, Joe. We know this, man. All right. And she said that was up. the old her. I feel like it's more than toe. Yeah, she going. You knew what I was when you met me. This bitch wasn't selling toes with Joe Bell. Nah. <laughs> nah, she wasn't doing. She have different tears. She put that pussy on Joe. She wasn't no road foot trip. model. Oh, wasn't no man. foot model. She put that pussy on the NBA player and caught him one. Caught her one. I did. That's what happened. Damn, Joe. So y'all, so Joe probably paid for that pussy the first time for real. I did. You think Joe gonna stick it out? Joe, go, Joe ain't going nowhere. He knew he had a hoe. He ain't going nowhere. He was waiting he on her to pop back out. He might not have thought that she was gonna re hoe, especially if she been asking him for some money like she insinuated. And he ain't had it. You gotta know what's coming. You gotta know that bitch ain't filling out no applications. This shit. <laughs> Man. She finna they don't get got no some kids, money. Though, I hope not. Damn. I hope not. But she finna get some money. She, he go get it to her. She finna go get it. That's fucked up, Joe. Hey, if I was a hoe, I'd have an OnlyFans. You got to. That's the easiest hoe man. money you can. Man, all right. Shit. You ain't man, even got to me. be fucking for real. Mm-mm. Got three children together. Three children. Damn. Damn. You know your mama on OnlyFans. Twelve ninety nine. I see your mama pussy every Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> And it's old pictures. It ain't it's even open, good open. <laughs> Re-releases. <laughs> okay. As soon as she take her clothes off, mm. it's be a hole already. Uh, uh, Damn, Joe. It smell why just you... like it look. Man, what? <laughs> Damn. It's that scratch and sniff? Damn, Joe. You should let that bitch go, Joe. Oh, man. Let that bitch go. You got to let that bitch go. Yeah. What you doing? You gonna let the bitch go? Yeah, I, yeah, that she can't be around me. I'm white, Mike. You gonna stick it out with the OnlyFans? Nah, man, nah. I ain't no fan of that. Nah, I ain't gonna finna be the only fan of that, man. Yes. I, I had to, I had to cut it off, man. And what if she had asked for you to do it with her? This, 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 it's different if you ask anyway. Like, period. You could have just yeah. asked to do this yeah, shit. Yeah, that, that's the principle of it. Yeah, all. you can't nah, just you like Jonah yeah. have a choice. Yeah, he didn't have no choice. Like Joe would have said no. Let me sit my body, my choice. She still would have done it. My body, my choice. That is why. But that is still true. Though. I it's mean, you're right. It's, it's technically it's her choice. That's not what it was made for. No, you're you, supposed to use it. Yeah, like that's that, what I'm like, saying. She <laughs> just yeah, she didn't flip that bitch around on Joe. But yeah, it is. It is your body. I guess you. Can. It's your choice. Either right? Joe can't tell you not to. Yeah, shit. my choice to stay a lead too. That, yeah, yeah, yeah. She got to get up out of here. Somebody got to go. She probably got the money now. <laughs> Look, I can't pay the bills. You just keep this motherfucker. <laughs> you think she going You think she gonna hit OnlyFans again? Oh, I yeah. she's staying on there. She viral she now. About to go, yeah, she about to yeah, go up now. She, everybody going to look for she Joe White. She got new content play. right yeah. now, every day. Every day. Every, every, every Thursday. Joe, she got a new yoga mat. Joe in the background with his arms crossed, right. man. You can just see it, Shay. You can just a silhouette. You can't now, bitch, see, if Joe. you going to do it, I'm going to watch. Right. <laughs> Oh, damn, terrible. In the corner, bitch, don't do too much. <laughs> damn, Joe. Damn, yeah, he, he hadn't responded yet either, from what I can tell. So. Uh, he Joe got to get up out of here. He better not say that. Get the bitch up out of here. I don't think he's going nowhere. If he knew he had a hoe, 
He ain't worried about it for real, for real. He knew he had a hoe. Um, I don't know what you did. You say you knew something about Mike Jones. Did you make a Mike Jones comment in the chat? No, I think you did that. But we, I, t- I know I shared the thing, but I didn't know if you would said something about it. No, I didn't. But we oh. can talk. Let's talk about it. Because Mike Jones out here, he ain't bullshitting with none of these motherfuckers. For That's what you said. <laughs> that, I knew you would say something. No, that was in real life, I said. It wasn't in the chat. Well, you said it somewhat. <laughs> it can't be somebody in the title that said the same thing as you. But yeah, um, who was the rapper? What's the, what's the NLE rapper? N.L.E. Chopper. N.L.E. Um, Chopper. Wanted to sample. Oh, damn, I just had it. Uh, it was one of Mike was Jones' back songs. back then? It might have been Still back Still tipping. No, nah, I don't know that. Um, and Warner is the label that NLE Chopper is doing his music through, and they went ahead and released the song without getting the sample cleared. Why the fuck? W- and the label did it this yeah, time. Yeah, the label did it. Man, get the fuck out of here. So. Still still tipping. So. We're going to court. Still tipping. Still, still tipping. tipping. still tipping on four foes. Oh, we're up there. I, four I like this shit, too. Yeah, me too. A lot of motherfuckers didn't know that was Mike Jones' song. That's Mike Jones' shit. Yeah. Everybody got on that bitch. Yeah. Um. What What was the date on here? That's what I wanted to see. July fifth. They sent it out. They They tried to contact uh, the folks who own the Mike Jones music and never got a response. And they were like, "Well, fuck it. We're just gonna put it out anyway." That ain't how this so shit now, work. Now, uh, they getting. Lawyers talk about what's going, what's going to happen with it, cause yeah, Mike Jones get all the proceeds of this shit now. Hey, that's how this shit used to work. I don't know if Mike solely owns that. I'm well, whoever owns it, I guess I should say. I, I guess not Mike Jones, but whoever owns this shit. That's how this shit happened. With what's the name? Um, Cardi B and Kodak Black. Oh, it was back then. Yeah, it was back then. They sampled back then. No, it's just, it's just probably similar to like settling yeah, out of court instead of in court. You gonna, you know, if you go buy it and get permission. It's probably gonna be cheaper than. Wow, we're just gonna use this shit anyway. Oh yeah, you know. See, what I mean? it was another motherfucker that had a Mike Jones sample, and he tried to put this shit out, and Mike Jones was like, "Hell no!" You remember we talked about this shit too. I don't remember. It was another motherfucker. Mike Jones ain't bull. That's why I said Mike Jones ain't bullshit. Y'all better leave his songs alone. I think. Remember, or whoever owned him, I don't know how to go. Last last time it was Mike Jones himself, goddamn it, because dude was mad about it for real. He was like, "I talked to nigga. You said hell no." Fuck around, be be like uh, P Diddy who who pay Sting five thousand dollars a day. Yeah, man. Okay, that, that for unclearing that. Uh, yeah, they said they said that shit was fake for real. Diddy came out and was like, yeah, I really think I paid him that much. Right. And nigga, how the fuck we know shit? <laughs> we don't know what the fuck going on out here. If you said it, then you did it. Fuck it. Know somebody else? I'd be mad as fuck if my label fucked up my song like that. that and then, yeah, you right. You can't even blame him. It's the label fault because they put this shit out. I mean, but he, he, I don't know, too, because he... He's been trying to do a bunch of flips on older songs recently and putting them out, and I haven't liked any of them really. Well, no, the um, the uh, what we doing, getting money, uh, that was that a hot point? That was just a little Wayne song that he flipped. He had Wayne on the song with him. Yeah, I'm I can't I'm heard this song. Yeah, that one was okay. The other ones, I didn't like the Nelly one. I heard one more that that was horrible. Yeah, the Nelly shit was a bullshit. Yeah, this shit was horrible. I heard one more, and I like dude. I got a couple of his songs on. I got one song where you tell a story about getting set up and shit. It, like it's a pretty good song. I got a couple of little songs with him on it. Like I like dude, but them songs he been putting out recently is ass. And I had I didn't hear the one with the Mike Jones sample. But um, if it's anything on par with the last couple he's put out, then that means it's ass too. That's probably why they why don't want to clear this shit. Yeah, I don't see why they would want to clear it if that's how it sounds. That's the only reason. But I'm he like wanted that. the mainstream famous was hell. You but cut Nelly the goddamn the check. Or whoever needed to clear the one for the hot. Clear that motherfucking check, hell. Yeah. That's how I shit. If I about shit, I don't give a fuck if the song trash or not. Shit. It yeah. ain't my, I'm not on that bitch. Shit. But the thing is, the I think for some people, because there are people who are big, well-known artists or trying to become that and kind of 
underground and bubbling and stuff, and they're young enough to have never heard some of this music yeah. and not know who the fuck none of these people are. They think are. it's this motherfucker's yeah. song. So when you hear it for the first time, that's the only place you're going to go back to. Oh, yeah. It's no his matter. song. And no, you could hear bitch. you could hear the real song after that. But we and did be this like, shit but every time I hear hot in here, I only We go did to this shit. We were growing up. Every time I, I let some old people hear rap music, they like, oh boy, you ain't that's the goddamn. They tell me where the shit came from, where they sampled the shit from. Yeah. But we a lot of times this shit are, It would be good songs though. Yeah. Now, yeah. And, and you can you would hear some of those songs enough that you would be able to reference the original song when you hear that. Not just the sample song that you learned. Yeah, see, most of them I ain't never heard the original. All I knew was the sample. Yeah, then. That's it. Well, see, that's what I'm saying. If the, if the only thing you know is the sample, and that's the only thing you go. Yeah, back that's to, what I'm saying. Now we, they all gonna go back to this horrible hell. ass and early chopper song. Fuck the beat up. Shit. Damn. Every time. So that's why I could see see an artist being like, "No, nah, I'm not gonna clear that shit. I'm clearing this shit. You gonna fuck my shit up." Mike but, Jones too, man. Cut that goddamn chick. I don't know. He might be doing all right, man. I'm I mean, Texas, I ain't saying Texas he broke boys, hell. Dude. I don't know. You doing all right enough, you be like, fuck that. Fuck it then. Shit. He don't need a shit. Fuck it. Yeah. Or maybe they probably ain't try to give him shit for real. Hell, they try to play him. They probably playing with him. Hell. Yeah, I was about to say, don't you say your own price when it comes to shit like yeah, that? You sp- yeah, you said your own. Whoever own this shit like this, this yeah. is what the cops are. Either get the fuck out, goddamn. Ain't no scale for this shit, bitch. What you want to do? Gee, um, I'm finna go sample Mike Jones' song. Bet. Which one we doing? Gee. All these scandalous hoes. I ain't never liked that one. These hoes. Who else is on that song? Who? Mike Jones. Somebody Who? else is on that song. Who gonna do that one? Yeah. What about the one Wayne did? Why not? We try, I'm trying to do one ain't nobody never did. Okay. All right. A new one. Um, I guess we, and then there were two. And then there were two left. What's two left? Oh, shit, the last two left. Yeah. We just happened to say these two for last. I don't this know how that how it worked out, huh? It's just how it worked out. Um, tell me about it. <laughs> 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 What's going on? There's an internet personality, a uh, social media, media man named... That goes by the name of DJ Academics. DJ Academics. Um, he be getting tough sometimes. Yeah, he he drink a lot, and he sit on his live. Oh, and he be drunk. Twi- yeah, he he go through oh, a whole bottle of him. Oh. I mean, he be a little tough because you could really because you could tell like, bro, you ain't tough for real. But sometimes like I don't know he, he like Jamaican and get shit. tough sometimes because he Jamaican. Ah, okay. All right. I bet he ain't <laughs> never been. Yeah. No, yeah, he goes and shit. At least he says so. Yeah, when he got money, he, he probably with. No, I think I don't know. I don't know this man. Like, I don't know. I guess you, he could. I don't know. He DJ tough. Academics. Uh, he has been trending the last day or two because Saucy Santana told him, "Well, Saucy so, Santana." So everybody know the city girls, right? Okay. This is what had happened, y'all. That yeah, what had happened because I'm sure y'all care about this. <laughs> no, but. <laughs> I'm somebody do. Um, <coughs> academics haven't been speaking too well on the city girls. Okay. And their music that they put out recently and things like that. He do that with a lot of people. All right. So uh, Saucy Santana decided to speak up for them because that's the homies. Okay, then. All right. And he said to academics, only bashes women and only has bad stuff to say about women, and he can't stand it, and it's ridiculous. Okay. Is that true? No, it's not true at all. Okay. Academics all right. bashes anybody and everybody when he wants to. And it's usually dudes, for real. He don't really talk about females often, honestly. But um, so academics then went online at some point, and I hadn't seen the video still. I, I don't know exactly what he said, but from what I understand – he ended up crying while he was trying to give an explanation about how he felt or what position he felt like he was put in at the at the <laughs> Oh. Oh. So he was saying that basically he doesn't want to offend the the alphabet community. But that's why he crying. But he, he trying can't, not to get canceled he, and well, fight with a gay person. Yeah, at he the can't. Same time. He can't really do or say what he want to do to this. 
blank, blank. I can't even say what I want to say. <laughs> he in a hard but spot yeah, right now. right, yeah. <laughs> like, they just really weighing on him right now. Oh, shit. <laughs> what you going to do to die, DJ? <laughs> so he said, you know, he can't, this Bati boy, he can't do nothing to this Bati boy. That's what he said. Oh, I'm so just, I guess that's like that's a fossil, uh, like okay, yeah, like that kind of thing. But, <laughs> so he he was really upset and beside himself, and I'm assuming he probably had a mostly empty bottle of Hennessy, like he does a lot oh, of times. He's crying and shit. But um, so after at, at some point, Sasha Santana had a video where he's talking, or there's a sound clip at least out where he's talking and saying that. Uh, he ain't trying to talk online. He don't want to meet academics online. He want to meet them. Um, uh, he don't want to meet because academics told him to pull up. That's what happened. Academics told him to pull up. To to where? To his house. Oh, okay. Because that's how people do that shit. And Saucy Santana was like, I don't want to see you at your house. I want to see you somewhere like where regular people see each other. Yeah. Like, and he named like three or four different places. No, it was, was like, like Walmart, yeah. bitch. Well, it wasn't that regular. The gas station. There, but basically, yeah, it might as well have been. <laughs> yeah, I want to see you so like by the park bench, like just Man, you know, what? somewhere, yeah, some regular, the not at your house. Bench. I don't know. I don't know what they do with where they live at. Um, but uh, he ended it by saying, "I'm a basically I'm a beat your ass, and then I'm gonna penetrate it too." Oh, he was going to fuck him, too? <laughs> That's what he said. Oh. He said he's going to knock him out and penetrate him or something like that. Don't allegedly. go meet that man. <laughs> so, don't go don't so. meet that man. <laughs> <laughs> don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> That's too much to lose in the fight. That's, That's too, too much, much to lose. <laughs> <laughs> That's way too much to lose in a fight. I don't want to take that chance. I'm not fighting. Fuck that. I'm not fighting. <laughs> Where's my gun? I'm not fighting. Fuck that. That is way too much to lose. You gonna fuck me too? Nope. Nope. Call the police. Because this ain't right. <laughs> Call the police. You didn't talk about City Girl. Now you're gonna get penetrated. Call the police. <laughs> you can't fight that man. Can you gonna fight him? I'm you can't fight that man. man. No, he you can't. BBL. You can't. <laughs> He wears heels and like runs around yeah, nah, and stuff. Fuck that, dude. Hey, no just... way up. I'm not fighting no man that runs in heels. You right. Period. Motherfucker gonna beat your ass. Motherfucker gonna shoot the fuck out of you. What you wanna say about me? You can call me whatever you wanna call me. Feel how you feel. I'm not fighting no. No. Man, all right. Motherfucker <laughs> live strong as hell. God damn it. Nigga run his man, gone. his stilettos. He go. What? Shit, shit, me. Yeah, nah. Hey. This... <laughs> I can't. No. You got to yeah. shoot. You going to do what? Bitch, and he got broad bad. shoulders, too. Man, right. Saucy Santana ain't a small person. I ain't seen him on TV. Or... That's fucked It'll up. Be TV, I guess. I don't know what else. I, I wonder what's... I hope they run into each other. I hope they run into each other. I hope he fucking That's not going to happen. They might see each other by the pork, bitch. <laughs> Academics ain't funny. He ain't, he's not going to lose none of his money for nothing. He ain't going to do it. But he do get, because he is whatever Jamaican or however, you know, the, the thing, how Jamaican people be about homosexuality and things like yeah, that. Yeah, they don't like that. Yeah, it's a, it's a very serious thing culturally where they're from and in their He got to fight now. Stuff. Just don't get knocked out. <laughs> don't get knocked out. <laughs> don't get knocked out. You better, you better have some people with you. So you better watch for the hook. Do. Better, I don't think about them. They wear a chastity belt. The, you better, the, people, <laughs> the people with you gotta let whatever happen gonna happen if you know what's gonna happen uh -uh. before you show up. No. Nah. <laughs> the people with you can't let you get penetrated. If if that dude tell you before you show up, no. I'm gonna whoop your ass. So the fuck what? what? So the fuck what? No. I feel like you ain't no, wipe that off the table. You knew what you signed up for, <laughs> <laughs> No. <laughs> what you think, Mike? You knew what you signed up for before you came. Nah, man. No. They, better, they better pull him apart. <laughs> no, right. Man. You better, you better, <laughs> you better That's stop the purpose of them coming along. Just yeah. like right. That's why you're here. I thought they just came to watch the fight. No, no. You here to save me if I'm I need saving. saving. This nigga get fucked. <laughs> Everything is over. Dang, now you a cuck hole. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, I'm just talking. You, you can't let him get fucked in front of you. <laughs> you can't let him get fucked in front of you. Damn. It's not the friends you want right there. Man, okay. <laughs> Why y'all ain't help? <laughs> <laughs> He's just watching this shit. 
<laughs> I'm shooting everybody out right. this bitch. <laughs> Ain't yeah. nobody see shit out here. Yeah. I'm gonna be crying while I do it too. Man, okay. Not because I'm I sad that I'm y'all. shooting. I'm sad of what happened. What you let happen? Man, what? <laughs> you should have stopped. <laughs> that's wild. That's a hell of a threat. Stay in the house. Man, that's is Stay that, the is that not house. unfair? I guess you know double standards. There is double standards. But that's unfair, though, right? Yeah, it's absolutely. That's why you can't do it. <laughs> but can't, how come? Like, dude, a dude can, can say no, that you to can't. <laughs> you can say you can't say that to no woman, though. right? <laughs> you can't say that to no yeah. woman. Like, You're wild, going to right? jail for saying that, right? He all online yelling. <laughs> Like, yeah, I feel like he should go. To, and I'm gonna penetrate. You. I feel like he should go Whoa. to jail for that too. I feel like that should be illegal for real. I feel like that should be illegal. Well, academics type that person. That's conspiracy. That could be a rape for for real. Do some shit like that. You might have called the police or something. That's just yeah, that conspiracy is. that could be a rape. Yeah, that, yeah, for real. You, <laughs> you told him your plan. <laughs> you can't. You do told that. everybody your plan. You can't do that. No, like, it's not like you was like I'm gonna train for the Olympics. He was like I'm gonna knock you out and penetrate you. You can't like, do those that. Two different goals. You should go. To One jail. of them is illegal. He should go to jail. <laughs> Fuck that. Ooh. And DJ Academic should go to jail for the traffic ticket he got. But they should be to jail. Damn. Yeah. So that happened. Um, I guess. Did Did you send me a Reddit? You ain't send me no Reddit. Yep. Yep. You sent me a Reddit. Right. Yep. Um. We could end on a lighter note before we get to that. Uh, congratulations, Kim Kardashian. Has, you know, What's Kim doing? She's hit yet another milestone. You got it. Kim Kardashian debuts Skims Ultimate Bra with built in fake nipples. <laughs> what? I feel like bitch has been doing this, though. I feel like this ain't new. With nipples? I feel like bitches been had fake nipples. That was built in a bra? I feel like, I, I, I feel like yeah. No, there's no bras with nipples built in. This the first one? It's a good idea then, but I, I feel like they've been doing um, this shit. But no, I see real, a lot more nipples on the shirts She lately. does, she does have a, a, a deal with the NBA to the NBA. exclusively, um, aside from this, to, exclude, to for skims with the NBA. They have a deal for skim men athletic wear or some shit like that they're okay. in talks with the NFL too All so right. she is making moves and stuff but yes today we're here to talk about <laughs> her bra that she released with built in nipples That's now you were up. saying that you've seen a lot of more a lot more what, what were you I've saying? seen a lot more nipples lately okay it has like been under freezing under shirts and shit no not like, like like in the past maybe a year or two like oh. it seems like a fashion trend has been coming back like around the show even perfect nipples nipples well, most of them, yeah, I guess yeah. so. Oh. I try not to pay too much no, attention. No, it sounds like don't you didn't know, try not you, to pay. You would notice, <laughs> you notice fake nipples. Guys. You don't notice the cloud, but you notice all the even perfect it's, nipples. Is that eye level? It's the eye so level. is your view out the window? Oh, I get, see the nipples. Right. I ain't see the clouds. All right, I see. I see. <laughs> I'm focused on right. other shit. I'm focused on other shit. Feel you. I feel you. Sometimes clouds got nipples. That's weird. Huh? That's weird. Yeah, it's huh? weird. They do. I didn't make them. You made it weird, though. <laughs> why does it got to be weird? You never seen clouds Why are you looking like at clouds like titties? I ain't seen clouds. That would look like a dinosaur. That would look like a titty. <coughs> All right. clouds more, I man. Think, I thought people only did that shit in the movies. Clouds got shapes? Just I'm saying, but just sitting cloud gaze. Oh, yeah, when I sit by the water. Yeah, nah, see, nah, I ain't never do that oh, shit. Yeah. Them strongs, man. Yeah, I, I look at the water. I look at the water, too. But he, yeah, let's talk about Kim K nipples. Not hers. Not hers. The one she built into bras. Yeah, so she everybody else got her nipples now. Is it a mold of hers? Selling nipples. I don't know. We just gonna say it is. All right. Well, everyone <laughs> that has Kim K's nipples, congratulations. Well, fuck it. <laughs> well, how would you feel if if like you chick wanted to get a nipple bra? I'm. I'm <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, it's weird, but fuck it, I guess. So it's weird. It's weird, but I ain't mad at your shit. You want fake nipples out this bitch? Get fake nipples out this bitch. 
I miss you with some water if you want me to. See, I'm just saying, wear t-shirt, show the nipples off, bitch. No, it's a bra. I know. This motherfucking it up, ain't it? <laughs> <laughs> I just fucked up the fake nipples. I do that sometimes. You try to make Kim's nipples be on everybody. Yeah, it's, I fuck it's up. It's a, a bra nipple. with nipples. But um, it's it's supposed to be a, a upside to it because she's donating some to cancer patients that okay. don't have nipples. <laughs> Did that make it even weirder? No. They prosthetic nipples now? I think that made it weirder for real. I was cool to yeah, I but I don't know. How, I don't know how that would feel to not have nipples. So I don't know. So maybe. Or if you don't got a titty and you want to put a bra on, and it look like you got maybe so. Yeah, chest. yeah, maybe so. Because you missing the boob. Maybe too. so. Yeah, sometimes yeah. you got both of them taken off. Or if you Britney Griner, you can switch back and forth. <laughs> maybe so. Right. I guess I would know how that feel. It just sounded <laughs> weird at first. Just prostate yeah, that's nipples. the upside. So. Everybody was talking about her selling the nipples, but she said there's cancer people who need it. It is cancer so people who need it. She's donating the uh, the skims bras. That's what's up. I don't know how much it costs if you don't have cancer. But <laughs> <laughs> I bet it's I bet it's expensive. I mean, bras are expensive yeah. too, no? Yeah. yeah, they are. So I get that one with nipples. Shit. <laughs> <Right>. Shit. <laughs> nipples. Do they, do they have like different size? You know I would have had that, but yeah. I thought I'd be going it? too far because he keep trying to make A everything weird about everything. Little nipple. Yeah. I would assume like if it's a C cup, the nipple ain't going to be the same size as a D cup, right? Maybe. But the, oh, so you can't change them. They built nipple. in. You can't like swap them out. Yeah, I don't know. That yeah. might be the next iteration of it. You uh, might need to sit in the idea. Hey, different size hey, nipples? I mean, all right. Interchangeable nipples. Yeah, interchangeable yeah. nipples. Shit, all right. One day you might have you might want to be different sizes. Oh, <laughs> you gonna forget and have two different Oh, don't do that. Hey, but that's real life shit though. Don't, but then yeah, I guess. Them nipples, yeah, the little pits of the it, <laughs> The two little nipples, they're just little dots. Yeah, they don't even look real. Well, for that's real. just the area. I mean, uh, yeah, that's just the nipple part. Yeah. You don't know what the areola look like because it's just a nipple in the bra. No, I think this is the point of it, right? So you, under your shirt, you can see the two little nipples. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't think it's, it's, it's an areola too. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that, no, that's why I'm saying it's not one. That's why it looked like that. Yeah. It's just a nipple. But yeah, that ain't that ain't that look fake. No. They look fake as hell for real. I feel like it's gonna be easy to tell the bitches what they got there. I don't know if this person already nipples. has boobs. But you know, the boob just bra. the nipples look fake though. I don't know. Whatever. Nipples are just bumps. I don't know how fake they can look. That shit real look fake look. as hell. Some I don't think I've studied them. nipples in the last two years like you have. Them so. bad nipples. Them bad nipples. I don't think them. I'm positive nipples. I haven't studied nipples the way you have in the last two years. I don't think years. them cam nipples. They You're should, they should go remote. They should have used the mold. I never saw nipples. the tape. I ain't see it neither. Oh. I, mean, I thought you were speaking from like knowledgeable. Yeah, no, nah, they got. I'd imagine they better than them nipples. Them I'd off, imagine they're about the same. Them bad nipples. I don't know, wouldn't expect it. Well, she does have money. She probably has. Like, yeah, you know she bought the nipples. Yeah, she probably has. Some nipples probably brand nipples. new. Is it store by, How do you where you buy nipples from? Medically bought? Medically bought? Doctor bought? The I doctor don't know. store? The, might have been black market The body market part nipples. store? It could have been black market nipples. It could have been. She ain't get no black market nipples. She could have. She just, got the good shit. If a bitch died nipples. with perfect nipples. She got the good nips. Kim been waiting on them nipples. She been waiting on them nipples. Y'all talked about it before she went. Is you an organ donor <laughs> or not? You stick to this or not? Because we had an agreement. Nipple swap. Oh, we ain't mature. We shouldn't be. <laughs> nipple swap. What the fuck? Fucking nipple swap. Congratulations, Kim Kardashian. I don't know. Like my, my, my. I don't know who don't have nipples and want nipples. Now you can get nipples. In the game. Congratulations. You didn't know it was going to happen like that. Now you know. I don't feel like Tell the family did. I feel like Kanye West had something to do with this. This sounds like a Kanye West idea. I'm going to give all the bitches nipples who don't got nipples. Or, or one of their kids. Or one of their kids. I could I could see that. But I feel, I feel where you're coming from, though. You're right. You were not wrong about that. Um, let me find this. 
I don't remember you sending me no, but you said you sent it. So. Magic. You no, know, you didn't see. I know. Yeah, I, I thought I did see it. I could have swore I did. Else. Maybe I sent it to something else. No, no, you didn't send it in nothing. It is unsent. Oh, I I might have screenshotted them. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know if you know what time it is. Do you know what time it is? I'm Ooh. looking at my phone, so I know what time it is. You know what time it is. And right now, I'm going to tell y'all what time it is. I ain't even got my watch on. I've been doing that shit lately. I've been not I wearing be, my watch and I've been looking at my wrist. My wrist yeah, off. like what? Like nigga, I ain't even know. I was oh, mad every time. It's my far. I, my my favorite part of the show, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know if it's what you've been waiting on, but it's what I've been waiting on. This right here is what us, the smokers, the people be blessed. I can't motherfucking talk. Blessed with the gift. The ability to be able to bring to you, to you guys, the best advice and you, and you ever known, ever known, out of all the people who've ever walked this earth, all the people, and some of the people who ain't ever even walked it before, some of them can't walk, they be crawling. We, us, us three, have come here to give you the best advice ever. You feel me? But not just you, because there's a lot of y'all, and it's we can't really find, like, you for real. Yeah. So what we do is we go on Reddit, and we read some shit off Reddit. Therefore, we call this shit Reddit on Reddit. Reddit on Reddit. And we get them the advice. Yeah. And if you in that, you ever in this situation, use this fucking advice. Yeah, like how they do at church. Because it's going to be the best advice you could ever get. Hands down. I don't know what that mean, but hands down. Yeah. <laughs> It's a lot of sayings that we got to we got to touch up, figure out what exactly they actually mean. I'm gonna mean. say the hands up. You're not going to jail, yeah. right? Sure. <laughs> Put your hands down. Man, okay. Yeah, all right. Nope. No. I'm not doing it. It's a trick. <laughs> it's a fucking trick. It's all a trick. He's going to shoot you. He's going to shoot you anyway. Yeah, you're right. My hands We're not going. Never mind. We're not going. Uh. <clears throat> Reddit on Reddit, ladies and gentlemen. Reddit on Reddit number one. Number one. Number one. All right, then. <laughs> this is a 25-year-old male and a 23-year-old female. Okay, then. The title reads, my girlfriend subscribed to my friend's content. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like, yeah, no, nah, because the first thing that popped in my head, because we didn't already talk about OnlyFans one time the day I read it. Is his homeboy got an OnlyFans and this bitch subscribed to it. This bitch got to go. Like, I don't even know, like. What if he's just like a gamer? He has a gaming channel. Then I guess it make a difference what kind of channel he got, too. It makes all the difference <laughs> yeah, in the world. Because sure, I just sure. kicked this bitch out because he what watches he the dude to? cook, goddamn. What is his channel? What if, what if he's on OnlyFans but he's just cooking? Shit, I, I, I guess fuck that shit, dude. I mean, but is he cooking naked? Like, what the fuck is like, hey, bro, <laughs> what's going on? Like, he's regular is cooking he, he away. Cooking? Yeah. Like, like, what's happening? <laughs> See, nah, fuck right. that. I, I'm, if you on OnlyFans, I'm assuming you naked, goddamn. No, folks got, like, shit that they do on there. They, they on the wrong motherfucking platform <laughs> for that. It started out, like. Yeah, I know. It yeah. started and out cooking still, and folks, shit, like, and math even, and shit. Yeah, even once folks got naked on there, folks were still doing, started doing new shit with, like, cooking and you shit. You fucked up. You around here teaching motherfuckers math and the bitch next to you showing up pussy. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's fucked up. I don't know. Um. Well, I guess let's let's get into it. Uh, it's well. What happened? You pre-read this, did you? I didn't. I didn't. I read the title. I told you what I do. I read the title. Not even a couple sentences. Because I be knowing. Is this what's going on? It's not that. It's just that you be having me read stuff. To... It's fine. All right. I don't be writing them. No, it's fine. I don't fine. be writing them. It's well known in our circle that my friend, 24-year-old male, is hung like a champion. Oh, shit. How the fuck? Oh, shit. These white people. <laughs> These white people. Black people don't know that about each other. <laughs> I'm just saying. 
It is well known in our circle. Yeah. After college, he started doing OnlyFans, and it's going pretty well for him. Every Wednesday night, my girlfriend goes to trivia at a bar with her friends. She did that last night and texted me when she got home around 11. She was pretty drunk and wanted me to come over, but I declined because I had an important meeting this morning. I knew I wouldn't get much sleep if I went over there. Today, I noticed that around midnight, she was on IG and liked about 20 of my friends' IG posts. Oh, shit, you did too much then. So I texted him to explain she was drunk and she sent and he sent back a screenshot from his OnlyFans DM. She subscribed to his account and DM'd him that he's hot. And she oh. hopes it's not weird that she subscribed and they can just oh, keep it yeah. between them. Oh yeah. He told me he didn't reply and doesn't want to be involved in any drama. But too late. I haven't spoken with her yet today, but we obviously need to talk about this. Mm-hmm. I'm just not sure how to approach this. Should I just what? break up with her? Mm-hmm. We've been together for 17 months. Or is this something we can work through? 17 months? Am I making a bigger deal out of this than it should be? It's a fucking baby. Mm-hmm. Seven, that's a year and a half. Yep. 17 months? Almost a year and a half. What the fuck? Seven, say, I'm just saying, you say a year and a half. No, because it's 17 months instead of a year and it's, a half. It's not a baby. You say this shit when you got a baby. <laughs> it's 17 I did, months old. I couldn't keep that shit up for nothing. Man, what? Year, this man. motherfucker a year no, and a half. Almost a year. Man, what? Right. <laughs> a little over a year. This motherfucker too. <laughs> a year. A year. Yeah, yeah nah, I don't think, yeah, years. fuck that. No? Like, you got to break that, break up with that bitch now for real. I don't, I don't even think it need to be really much of a conversation had. Right? Yeah, you ain't got to talk about shit for real. I ain't nothing Nothing's, to talk about. Like, like you subscribe to this motherfucker's on the fans. You want to see his dick? Fuck you, bitch. And you inbox him. Yeah, man, yeah. Man, what? All right. And ask him to betray my trust. <laughs> and then, yeah, she didn't even go us. in uh, covert or nothing. She went in there coming hot. You yeah, feel me? Like keep it between us. And right? then. Went on Instagram and liked a bunch of pics. Twenty of them. Dumb ass Not even one of them. Twenty of them. Alright, she don't give a fuck about you neither. She don't. She don't care nothing about you finding out of nothing. Like twenty pictures nah, on Instagram. I'm like, yeah. Just move on. She know you gonna see that shit. Yeah, she'd have moved on already. You might as well too. I ain't in my Fuck Damn. that. Yeah, that's the best advice you're gonna receive from anybody anywhere, anytime. Leave that bitch alone. Like Run. right now, goddammit. Yes, Get the fuck on. Cause that bitch ain't no good. <coughs> Tell your friend to see it. Let her subscribe, though. She <laughs> <laughs> don't be hating. <laughs> yeah, tell them get that money. Shit. I ain't tell them get just shoot you a finder's fee or something. I ain't a ten percent or something. A little referral fee. Be a, little, 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 first a, month, a little first month cut or something. I go get all the bitches for you. All this girlfriends. <laughs> <laughs> I'll that's just get a girlfriend up. and I'll just let her be you. They say they're well game. known in the circle, so. Yeah, that's, yeah, weird, no, that's weird too. Wild. That's weird that's as fuck. Weird. No? Yeah, that is some weird shit. That's weird as fuck. Well, maybe that's the silver lining. Maybe he don't got to get rid of it. Maybe they all going to do some shit together. I'm, okay. If the friends all know about it, maybe they just, you know, do things like that. Maybe they the maybe. alphabet community Now, nah, I feel like, you know. He want to kind of have a conversation, nah, you, though. That's you know how Mountain do white people do weird shit. How Mountain Dew white people? Yeah, you know, you, you don't know Mountain. You know what Mountain Dew white people is. Just do it. Just, you know what I'm saying? The ones that just woo, <laughs> jump, yeah, <laughs> get naked and jump off the cliff. God damn it! What, can you run that back to what? Mountain Dew white people. What is it? you ain't Mike? You, I'm sure you've met some white people that only drink no. fucking Mountain Dew all day long. Yeah, just, I have. And, and yeah. be turned the fuck up all day just. Or do anything, yeah. I've never heard. Of Made that. their pants in the shorts. <laughs> <laughs> Wear the sandals with no socks. Yeah, twenty six degrees outside. I just outside. made it up, but it just—I was trying to think of how to describe. Okay. Yeah. It's All like, right. Yeah, man. I'm the, do, man, do white people. Okay. Yeah. He said it like it was a regular thing. I know. So I, I be doing. Really I be confused. trying to slip it in there so it catch on. <laughs> no, stop, stop right there. And stop right well, there. I like that. With that's, with I think Mountain that's Duke. a good description. What I'm trying to yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, it's that's a very PG one too. Yeah, so I, yeah, yeah. I usually think, they do that after a beer, not a Mountain Dew. Like, but you know, I guess it might Mountain Dew at daytime. No, nah, it'd be beer all day. I yeah, think they moved day. from Mountain Dew to beer. <laughs> I think I think they might be the same was. Well, Mountain Dew to, to uh, never mind. No, you do the, they do the cocaine the whole time. <laughs> 
I knew they've been doing cocaine since they were twelve. Trying to take drugs, trying to get less and less drugs. <laughs> well, I'm gonna add more drugs. Cause now, cause you think keep, cause keep you make them think the it's the Mount Dew, but it's not really the Mount Dew. It's the cocaine. It's the cocaine for real. <laughs> Do a bump, take a sip. <laughs> Real, jump off the fucking thing, <laughs> butt ass naked. Yeah. yeah but they tried to get me to jump off that bridge after they explained that there was like a bus yeah, under the water. You gotta land in the shit. right spot. Yeah. yeah they nah, tried me with like, some shit like this. Like, like, you can like, jump off, but just don't go over. Yeah. No. And when you get in there, you gotta swim this way. We'll be down there to grab you. Okay, bro. None of this bro. shit. None of this shit. <laughs> you got There's it. There's not no fucking line back there. I'm not jumping off this fucking cliff. <laughs> That's all there is to it. Man. You look like a pussy. Like, bitch, I'll throw you off this bitch. <laughs> you keep talking shit. But, yeah, let's, I'm not. Let's see how many times you say that and what changes. Man, I, I, I'm, I'm what not going to jump off this bitch. <laughs> right. That's some life-threatening shit. But like this blunt and watch out, okay? Right. If I jump off this bitch, I think it's death behind me right now. That's the only way I'm jumping off this That's bitch. Why. I know a bunch of people had, like, a group of white folks that, Invited them to jump to their death in some water. Oh, yeah. If you get around Mountain Dew white people <laughs> and there's a cliff and there's a water. That's the name of the episode? <laughs> maybe so. But you you going to be challenged. To, and it's going to be a lot of peer pressure. It, it ain't no, no, no he's not going to do it. We drove to a particular bridge. Yeah. It, well, if you get around Mountain Dew white people for they long enough, go. I, yeah. you going to be challenged to jump off a cliff. That's why people think my name was Bob. <laughs> okay. Bob really. didn't do it. Right. Who's Bob? Yeah, ain't nobody looking for me, nigga. <laughs> See, <they>, Kano <laughs> <can't, laughs> didn't do it either. <laughs> ain't it <right? laughs> I didn't do it either. I might have been Mario. For real. Oh, man. But yeah. Oh. Um, that's how they yeah. end up naked. I guess that's how the old crew know. But yeah, maybe I don't know. I'm just saying, maybe there's a silver line, and maybe they can, maybe they'll find something out about each other. Leave her alone. Get down together. It definitely bothered him. But she, kind of yeah, he he on ready with it. Even if they do go, even if bit. they is gonna try to get out or something like his pride. They shouldn't, cause she's she's still sneaky with it. Yeah. She can't be trusted. If that was the case, she should have been like, hey, you're free and shit. Like, yeah. She trying to be sneaky and shit. She don't know he... he Ain't but one way to find out, God damn it. I don't know. Hmm. It's well known. All right, shit. take the silver lining off. I tried to give him I'm some grace. I'm just saying. She Rude, still trying to be the sneaky. silver lining. <laughs> Get the rid of that sneaky part, bitch. Fuck yeah, yeah. Fuck and that. I guess, I guess his friend... Was his friend a good friend for showing him the screenshot? Yeah, yeah. Friend, no, it's, no, he should have absolutely said something. Absolutely. Don't not say nothing. Don't just well, let me did. think my bitch out here not but trying he, to see your did. dick. He didn't say, <laughs> but he didn't say nothing until after he texted him. You did too. That too. He probably should have like, hey, yeah, next time you, you you could. But he did say he didn't want no drama, so he probably wouldn't. I just wait yeah. for him to say something to me, and I'll tell him. Y'all think the friend gonna fuck her? Probably, mm -hmm. probably so. <laughs> probably <laughs> so. He should. I don't see why he would. No, nah, he shouldn't. <laughs> this is friend. <laughs> And he got emo he got they emotions the about the bitch. They he got emotions men. about the bitch though. Don't fuck the bitch if your friend like the bitch. For don't real. save her. She don't but wanna yeah, be he saved. He probably gonna don't fuck the bitch. Her. But don't be mad at your friend. You knew I was like this before. It's a hoe, right. man. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you knew what you was when right. you met her. Yeah, Shit. Right. <laughs> Let mm. that hoe go. I don't know. I'm wondering about the friend a little bit, but all right. Yeah, he should have said something earlier too. Yeah, like, hey bro, the bitch is hitting me up. Yeah, what? This bitch just subscribed to my shit. Mm. Yeah, leave that bitch All alone. Right. Well, let's let's keep it moving. Um, Reddit on Reddit number two. Number two. Number two. The title is. Hold on, cause I ain't see it until now. Cause you said it over there. This motherfucker sound just like Casey Kasem. Oh, <laughs> you mad? Just like I wasn't gonna say it no more. Cause it would be like I'm being an asshole, I'm being a dick again. Like I was, oh nope, shit, I'm gonna... it's the first time I heard it. Hey, sounds perfect, man. Man, I don't okay. Understand. So every time, <laughs> hey, I, uh, I, well, I I listen to a lot of top top forties. Hell yeah, my me mom too. always listening on radio, so yeah, absolutely. Hell yeah, yeah. Weed that's why. Mouth? That's how I know why. What you sound like? <laughs> man, okay, <laughs> hey, all the time. You yeah, knew most of the songs on that motherfucker. The title is "I'm Turning Into the Bitter Old Man and Want to Stop It Before It's Too Late." Oh, see, it's two parts to this sentence right there. You got the first part. Well, the bitter old man is in quotations. Air you got quotes. The second part. You could have just ended this sentence 
after the word man and left this shit where it was. That's all I'm saying. The rest of this shit ain't even need to be said. Why not? Because fuck that shit. Accept that shit. Why? What What you mean, why? Fuck this mean, shit. If you want to be a better old man. But he just said you, he, he doesn't want to. <laughs> you ain't, no, nah, he want to because he doing it. He ain't, you going. Lean into that shit. That don't mean he wants to. Tell the motherfucker stay off your grass, goddamn it. Tell him motherfucker, hit the cat with your cane if it's in your yard. Yeah, you be hitting cats with canes? I don't have a cane. I don't, I don't <laughs> need to do that, a dog. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna come around? You hit cats with dogs? Yo, I throw this dog at him. Oh. <laughs> Get a bitch. <laughs> no, no, no. Damn. Bit old man. I, I told you, I'm become a bit old man and I'm, fuck this shit. I'm on the porch. Get the fuck out of my yard. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm fuck fine. With, I'm fine with that. I I could understand now at this point in my life why people would do that. A nice old man is creepy. Yeah. A nice old you man keep, is you creepy. You keep making the shit it's, weird. Hey, is it not? An old man is too know, nice to you is creepy. Be. Yeah, yeah. You you ain't watch Mr. Rogers. Mr. Rogers creepy. creepy, yeah. You creepy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> a nice old man is creepy for real. It don't no, happen like some that. There's nice old people that's not creepy. I don't know. There are. You got to be mean sometime when you're old. You just, no. Yeah, you got to. You just got to be It's consistent. some cute couples. Yeah, but you, you fuck around and, and step on that old man's shoe. You going to know. She gonna have to get her husband. Up sprinkler system. Shit, all right, all right. <laughs> Run over her fucking flowers with the lawnmower while you do it in the yard, goddamn it. Run over them days as if you want to. Second week in a row, he didn't Shit, weed. all right, all right. <laughs> Shit. All right, let's see what he said. <laughs> um, I'm beginning to hate people. Distance myself and prefer to be left alone. Yeah. Everything irritates me and it's yep. scary. Mm-mm. I remember working for a bitter old man who yelled a lot. Don't do that, though. Blood was pressure. always angry be and mad. been alone for years. Now I'm turning into that guy, and I really don't want to. Don't be. You can't be angry, though. You, you do got to work on that. Because when you get old and you're angry and you yell, your blood pressure and shit, you ain't going to be a better old man for long. Yeah, you're probably, probably going to die quicker. <laughs> what if that's your joy? Huh? What if that's your joy? Just fuck it. I mean, you're going to do it for a little wanna while. But he want to change, though, right? Yeah, he, he said he don't want to be a bitter old man. I don't, I can't. He got a lot of work to do. He's a little late in the game. He about right. That's why quarter, he reaching almost out. Over with. How old, how old that's why we here. here. I don't think he said. My, see, my advice yeah, ain't going to say. It ain't going to be what he want to hear. All I know is if. If you don't start changing earlier, the older you get it, the harder yeah, it is to late. change. It's too late, yeah. He, he noticing that you shit. Know, that old saying, you Once can't. Once you notice it, it's probably because somebody pointed it out to you. Because <laughs> motherfuckers ain't going to believe it. You got to point it out for a little while, God damn it. Like, maybe I am. I do be. <laughs> maybe it is man, me. Man, okay. <laughs> man, all right. You know, he probably just uh, is not... Life just probably lifing. Yeah, yeah. That shit be happening. Life just probably lifing. And until shit turns, I bet if shit turned around in two days, you wouldn't feel the same way. That's my assumption. I feel like this shit's some ongoing shit. Yeah, he's been dealing with some shit for a while. Nigga, credit bad and everything. That's fucked up. He old too. <laughs> Fuck that credit now. Shit. Yeah, it it almost you... feel like a guilty conscience too. Like he trying to get right before he. You know, go or leave or something too. Oh, like, damn, you know he dying? Man, okay. He you know old, what I mean? Old. I don't know. I feel like he saying. about 50. Yeah, I don't think he that old. You don't think he you 50 think he yet? Uh-uh. We said old, bitter. Yeah, he, he like, becoming, I think thinking like plus 60 he when becoming, I think bitter old. Maybe he might be about 60. He become a bitter think, and old. I wouldn't uh, say 50 years old. I feel like he close to old. He, he realized he headed to when he get he old, he's going to be bitter. Yeah, I feel like he trying to make it right. I think he probably like... 40? 40? 45? 45. Maybe 43. 43? Yeah. What that mean? Yeah. <laughs> you mean, man, well, you think you're an old man at 40? Yeah. yeah no, nah, he me, mean, God damn. Nah, but if you could, you don't necessarily have to be like full fledged, but if you could see like some times where you'd be like, huh, I didn't really want to be around none of them people. Or, uh, 
Yeah, I was kind of snappy in that situation. I'm using if you, it, 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 he might not necessarily be all the way. He just act like a or act like an old ass man already. He was saying like, he could be saying like, I'm starting to see these things and I don't want to turn into that old. It seemed it makes me think of that old man I used to work for. I don't want to turn into that. That's old where you're man. going. That's where so you're going. So what do I do to stop these things from old, starting to you, pop up now? When you get old, you get mean. Old people mean. I don't think all of them. I see. I don't think. I I think, I see I think they faking them. if they're not. I don't, I don't I know, because so. I see the ones that are, I think too. all the old people ready to stab you all the time. You can change if it, you want to change. It depends on how much uh, land you got, I think. It depends on how much land you got? Yeah. I they don't want to stab you if you got some land? No, nah, if they got land, they don't want to stab you as much. Yeah, especially if you want that land. No, nah, well, if you're supposed to be there. Yeah, yeah no, nah, yeah, if you're supposed yeah. to be there. Yeah, they, no, nah, they still want to they stab you secretly. Yeah, hey, don't drink it. No, it ain't no <laughs> okay. It's to come out the package over there. It's still got the seal okay. on it. That might yeah. work. That might I work. I don't drink it in front of them. Nigga, I always take it back to the truck. That might work. Because sometimes I don't drink it. Man, I ain't stinking here. It's a drink stink. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I don't know what you can do except Eat to, your vegetables. to actually work on it. Cause when you get you I, have to actually, when you get when like happens, you gotta, like clogged you gotta, up and shit, you, it, you it make you grumpy, goddamn. Mm-hmm. You can't be walking around here, got to do the shit for real. Um, so eat your vegetables. Um, think about stuff that you, that you used to enjoy. Exercise. And see if that's something that you still do in life. And if it's not, maybe find a way to try to put that back into your life. Things that made you happy before. If you're already doing that or don't have time for that, then figure out something new that you could do. You got to find you some you time if you're getting old, too. Yeah, you got to. Fuck well, this shit. That's what happens when you're getting old, too, is that's why you start getting up early. Because your other, your only time is going to be if you get up and make more time out of your day. So now you got to get up early, which means you got to go to bed early. So I guess he is old. You're old now. So don't even worry about that old <laughs> shit. Eat your vegetables, exercise. Get a life alert bracelet. Damn. That's how y'all, I'm going with y'all now. Fuck it. At 45? 50 or 60? Like, like that? What? Oh, yeah. Jesus. AARP. Shit, uh, man, what's right. the other thing? Don't you get to sign up with something else too? I don't wheel? know. You talking about making a wheel? What man, yeah, you gotta, right. yeah, you need a wheel. You need to tell people, everybody talk to your parents about where they want to be buried at. Yeah, you need to talk about yeah. if they don't have a will, and if they do have a will, make sure it's in there where they want, what they want to happen to their body, and where they want to be placed. Important thing, absolutely. Since will came up, sorry guys, but oh, yeah, and not just your parents and shit. Like I guess you too. People dead, motherfuckers should know shit. I don't got nothing. Somebody need to know for everybody. Hell, cause shit be happening. Yeah, you never but I, know. But I think you're right though. I think he, he's noticing that. Especially mentioning as uh, somebody I used to work for, you know, that he's starting yeah. to realize that damn, I'm trying to, I'm starting to be like that man that I didn't really like working for. Or what, being right. a, don't want to become a better old man. So. Right. I don't want to be no better old man. I don't give a fuck. I think I'll I don't be mind mean being. And, and when I get there, I feel like mean. I'm gonna just yeah. But I I don't want it to be because I'm old. I don't, I don't want to. I'm gonna be I don't, better. You know what I'm worried about is being a horny old man. Oh okay. I, I don't want to be like 80 years old and still want to fuck something. I'm still want to fuck something. Yeah, but ain't no... But I ain't just going to be like at the club and shit. Well, no, no. Is that what horny old man means? I think so. Like, no. you you out here. I mean, like, uh, I you know the mean old... You want to fuck. The, the old, no, I think... Yeah, you know, I feel like horny old man is the old motherfucker who shouldn't be out here at this club, just out here, goddamn, but just... No. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna be One that old. One of these go get me some pussy. <laughs> <laughs> that old, nah, I see, boy, never mind. We could talk about my stuff. Oh shit, that boy, that's that guy. It never fails. It be going down. Like it's obvious that y'all, never mind. All right, um, damn, I didn't know that's what horny old. I thought you mean like you was an old man that be horny. Shit, I, I hope so then, cause I, I hope I still want to fuck when I made it for real. I don't know if I'm gonna be fucking when like shit. I don't know what age I want to stop at, but shit, I want to be. I fucking. don't know if eighty sounds like fun. Shit, <laughs> just do it slow. Shit, <laughs> <laughs> I had no fuck choice. That. I had no choice. I was buzzing. Maybe, maybe. Couldn't um, imagine I ain't had no pussy in twenty years, motherfucker. What? Why'd you stop at sixty? Nah, you you might be ninety now. You stopped at seventy. Oh. Mm-hmm. See, uh, uh-uh, uh, fuck that. Twenty years? Fuck out of here. I might as well die. <laughs> mm. 
I don't really want to be that old anyway. I, I mean, it depends on how I help. If I could, if I could get around and shit, yeah. I don't want to just be somewhere laid up, goddamn it. Yeah. Pop, pop, a hundred and three. I don't want to do that. I don't want that to happen. <laughs> hey. Well, you got to do I seen a woman at, at Walmart the other day, and that motherfucker was so bent over, like, man, I, I hope I ain't <laughs> never got the old. Hope that don't never happen to little, me. I, that, that worried me since I was like, since I can remember. Man, okay. I always thought about, like, man, I don't want to even get gray hair because then you're going to start being bent over. I thought it happened to everybody. No, just everybody. When you get yeah, gray hair, I thought it happened just, to everybody. Like, nigga got a gray hair. God damn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. God damn. Punch back another time. Man, okay. It's fucked up. Um, 256-788-7339. Leave a message. Ask the smokers at gmail.com. Text the motherfucker. Um, Comment, like, subscribe, share. That shit. Leave a review. The bell. Hit the Rate bitch. it. This is the Reverend Cato Jackson. This me. That's Off White Mike. That's Off White Mike. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm Bob Jaquez. That's Bob. Uh, don't forget, um, fuck iron and, unless you have to. If you do, turn your shit inside out. Pull the pockets out. If you don't, go get you a turn steam. It, turn it inside out. It's some new shit, ain't it? Yeah, you got to do some, some of your shit. Like, it got print on it and shit like that. Is that like a print thing? Yeah, yeah. yeah. If you iron that, you got to turn that bitch inside yeah, out. Yeah, I ain't even iron that bitch. You going to fuck up the bear. Don't iron that bitch. See, I be giving y'all. steamer. Some, some of y'all ain't got a steamer, though. So if you got to iron it, shit like that, turn steamer it inside out. Steamer costs less than iron. Some of them ain't got a steamer. And you right. don't want to use this Alabama water. You out in the country. Your water might be a little bit better. Maybe. I don't know. Mm, you do water. Anyway, get you if you don't got a steamer, that's how you iron. Turn inside your shit inside out. out if you need to. Pull your pockets out. Otherwise, get you a steamer. Remember, cinnamon is not sweet. Um, stop, stop it. It's not sweet. It's enough of that. Eat some of this shit. Um, a spoonful. And she of know all the words to Gucci Mane and Jeezy Burr. and and uh, Rollo. Then it's just, who is Rollo? It's because all she did was ride around with dope boys all her life. I don't even just know who Rollo is. Um, <laughs> I ain't no you got something Let me see. Um, smoke a blunt with your mama. Smoke a blunt with your mama. Um, <coughs> your smoke. favorite drug dealer. <coughs> he probably disability. on disability. Damn. <coughs> Tell on, your bitch. Come on. Tell your bitch to quit smiling Tell at me. Quit doing it, man. <laughs> I don't know what, what <laughs> the That's fuck be nah, going man. on. Stop it. So I saw I don't, you. I don't understand. Like, bitch, I'm not going to come say nothing to you. I saw you. Tell your bitch to quit smiling at me. I'm going to start tapping you niggas on the I shoulder. Like, hey, you. bro, <laughs> tell your bitch to quit smiling at me. I saw you. Um, Look like you want to buy me something. And some. then it might be the last one. Like, you might feel played. And shit, if you feel played, air this bitch out, goddamn. Hey, man. That's the best advice I can give you, shit. <laughs> Mike, Smoke you got some, 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 some bits just, of wisdom to drop I, on? I just got one, man. If if you got a hoe like Joe, let her go. Let hey, that hoe go. <laughs> hey, man. That's Two things I, I ain't never seen before. A UFO? Nope, I think I, I might have. UFO. A hoe that one go? One thing I ain't never seen before. One thing for certain. Two things. One thing for sure. Two things for certain. If the bitch out here working, the bitch can get the gone. Wow. I can't think of nothing around. Thank y'all for joining us. We'll see you next time. Smoke a minute, uh, that smoke a minute podcast. Peace. Okay, breathe.